2018 edition, I as always am your host, Norman Lion. Nick is away today. He's been replaced by Josh. Everyone's moved up one level. Yeah. Ooh. Josh is Nick today. Hi. I'm Nick. Great impression. <laughs> yeah. Hafu is good. Rob. Oh, hi. I, I don't know how to do a Rob impression. Hi, I'm, I'm Rob. <laughs> yeah, no, that's perfect. Yeah, I'm, I'm very much like a sheep. Yeah. I say ba all the time. And <laughs> Rob is Chet. Uh, uh, Rob is wrong. <laughs> but I'm Rob, still me. Dot, dot, dot. Uh, and we're going to play, you know I'm still me, because we're going to play golf, and then we're going to play GeoGuessr, and then we're going to play uh, some trivia murder party. Shall we begin? By yeah, the way, begin some begin. people in chat, we're, we get to have like an hour-long secret, okay? Because I know there's going to be viewers who are only going to show up after an hour because North America went through daylight savings, but Europe All didn't right. yet. Like, our daylight savings time is now over. Yeah. So when they come, we've all got to say, we've got to have, like, a catchphrase. And the catchphrase should be, like, I don't know, something. You suck. Uh, check your clock. You suck. Check your clock. <laughs> yeah, have a time to get a new, right. time to ooh, get a new ooh. clock. Was and it two days ago? New clock. Yeah. And if you type it out, the check should be spelled C-Z-E-C-H. Okay, so it would be, what? like, check your clock. Does that work? Yeah. C -Z you, you suck. Check your clock. <laughs> <laughs> sure, whatever. Sure. You do whatever you want to do if that works for you. We're going to start it up. Forest class. We've been playing so much golf with your friends. What levels do we never play? Haunted. Spunky. I've never played that. Yeah. Oh, that means I'm going to have like 200 strokes. We Hafu, all everyone has 200 one. strokes. This one is oh. actually garbage. This is terrible. I've definitely had way more okay. than 200 strokes in my life. I've never okay. stroked. How did you guys, uh, and instead of asking like how was your weekend, how did you deal with daylight savings time ending? Do you notice? Are you, dude? It wrecked what? me. Really? Yeah. What do you mean it wrecked I, I don't know. I spent like half a day dreading it. I was like, oh no, the clock's going yes. ahead an hour. I'm gonna get one hour less sleep. And then when I woke what? up on Sunday, I was like, I just don't feel right. Like I feel like I'm permanently out of sync with the day. What's yeah. wrong with you? I don't know. Yeah. What? You're an old person. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you, you are. That, that is exactly Thank what you. That That's the nicest thing anyone has ever said to me. <laughs> what? what are you? What? <laughs> I'm, it's an hour. Yeah, but oh. it's like the best like, hour. You, know, like you, you just got back from like Korea, I was going to say. I feel like this wrecked you more. <laughs> much of Time well, I think that's the thing is like I was almost I was like 99% of the way through jet lag and then daylight savings is like Sorry Like you, you got to start over from scratch through, like you might as well have just like gone to Saskatchewan and there'd be no difference Yeah, well, it's ironic because Saskatchewan has no daylight savings time <laughs> really? Saskatchewan could save itself from <laughs> death but. <laughs> <laughs> Saskatchewan and oh. uh, Florida is getting rid of daylight savings time, and Arizona is getting rid of daylight savings time. Wait, really? What? Wait a minute, they can just decide? Yeah. Hasn't Arizona yeah. already done Arizona that? does not even have daylight savings time. It's true. What? Yeah, and I think there's there's parts of Illinois and Indiana that don't do... Oh, wait, maybe that's just... Yeah, I don't think that's the daylight savings. I don't know. Something like Dude, that. Dude, it's not. Awesome. It's not a totally foreign thing. I want to hear, what? like, an AMA from somebody that, like, lives <laughs> in Nevada... But they go to Arizona for work across the state line, and like, what's that like? Probably pretty mundane. I imagine you get used to it, but I want to hear it straight from the horse's mouth. <laughs> Why are you getting to call your viewership horse? I'm not. Ho it's a noble animal. I'm in Nevada. What's Nevada yeah, like? Yeah, yeah. But do you work in Arizona? Oh no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> right. Yeah. Actually, <laughs> <laughs> Get a job in Arizona. Yeah, get a oh job in Arizona. Then get a job idea of a commuting streamer. Commuting oh. streamer. Some people yeah. do that, and I've actually um, what? I got to stream at the Red Bull headquarters mm. when I lived in Santa Monica, and it actually felt like a like a job, like I was going to work. Did it feel better or worse then? It felt. <clears throat> See, that's what I need. Like, if better. I could go to like a my job would be doing this, yeah. I would love it. Well, Dude, I mean, but actually, fuck that. I would hate commuting to stream. That's here. like one of no, the best be things in. about streaming is, well, to some extent, you set your own hours until you make a schedule and then you're beholden to that forever. Uh, yeah. But you don't have to commute. So, like, you don't have to worry about traffic. You don't waste time driving. Like, 
yeah. it's all good. I'm yeah. in my underwear right now. Okay, but that's but like, like ridiculous because <laughs> it's <laughs> 6 p.m. Like your own, time. My own damn house. Yeah. I never put on pants in my own house. I always put on pants in my own house. No. Uh, like weekends, pants are totally optional. Yeah, there's no pants. But like this no. fucking Monday evening, I don't know. Yeah. But like oh I don't my. live Rob's life. But I'm okay <laughs> with it because he doesn't. His his responsibility for the day was show up on the NLSS. Yeah, and I only told and him that, about and, that. Like and he found that about you know two minutes. Yeah, b- basically <laughs> correct. Yeah. Well, Josh, you're the only one of us that actually works, like, yeah. at all. Oh, my God, <laughs> wait, no. Here's the thing. Like, what, what, do you do, did, what do you do when you get home? I, I Today I made some... No, no, no I mean, like, clothing-wise. Like, are you still wearing uh Oh, I'm still... Yeah, work so, clothes? like, at work, it's jeans, and, like, I wear plaid shirt every day. Oh, well, it must be nice. So, like, yeah. What's it like to so, work like, at a Canadian restaurant? It's okay. <laughs> yeah, wait, did you just describe, like, a lumberjack outfit? <laughs> Jeans and yeah, a much. plaid shirt every day. No! I, well, oh, the thing is, I never told you guys what I do. Oh, that's so, true, yeah. yeah. Well, to be fair, um, I never asked. Yeah. I'm just going to tell you. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lumberjack. I, I'm, I, when I go to work, I go to work as a Canadian. Hey. Oh, that's good. Um, so, no, if, if I could get a job streaming where I would just commute, I would say, like, 30 minutes even away i would do that as long as like i didn't have to do like any like the tax if i got a w-2 for that shit it'd be great what is that oh you don't want to do like your own taxes yeah also i'm not playing on your current board so oh now i am Mm. it's weird well you get a you get a w-2 from twitch no you get a 1099 from twitch oh yeah you're right you're right you're right yeah whatever correct (laughs) exciting (laughs) tax yeah (laughs) yeah Uh, if Did I got like a W two and a four hundred one k, I'd be all about it. So you don't know J- Josh's story is that he went to he quit his job. This is like two thousand thirteen, right? Yeah. Went to Australia, was doing the full time streaming thing for a while, and then was like, eh, it's not for me. So now he's got a job as a, a normal person, and he just he donates his time on Monday, like some kind of it's a charitable cause that doesn't cost him any money. It gains me money, though. Mm, I don't know. You might want to check your uh, your records on that. Oh, <laughs> what do you mean? You're ouch. not gaining any money from me. Oh, no, but, like, people subscribe. To oh, me. really? I don't give a fuck about what you... <laughs> <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> what the... <laughs> no, like, the only way I can get paid is through you paying me? Oh, look, <laughs> I, I just... I speak about what I know. That's it. I don't like this implication. What? Ryan, like, you're not sub to Josh? Uh, I am sub to Josh, uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, he, he wasn't sub to me until people subscribed for him. I don't really want to draw attention to this, but I am <laughs> still, as of yet, unsubscribed to Hafu as well. Uh, but it's kind of, like, on my list. It's like... Uh, all be- people always sub me to you. So, I actually, I've never spent money on you either. It's okay. <laughs> We're good. We're chilling. Oh. Oh, I get it. She's on your list. I'm not on Well, you're not on my list anymore you. because somebody subscribed me to you. Yeah. Someone oh. subscribed me to, like, Nick over the weekend. I've been subscribed mm-hmm. to Nick. Maybe it was last week. Yeah. Ah, no! But it was weird because it was, like, during my... I don't even know. I don't know how it worked. It was weird. Oh, wait. Someone subscribed this? Nick to me oh. as well. Uh, I, don't, I, don't know. I don't understand the world and how it works. Like, I'm going to be honest. I have, uh... I think I have, like, 11 active subscriptions... So, and I, that's a fair amount. They're not like nobody's going anywhere. Well, mm. I'm still subscribed to Josh, which is like, yeah, I don't know. At this point, <laughs> give me that money. <laughs> I don't know. Basically, donating like a couple bucks to Twitch a month, but yeah, yeah, yeah. dude, I, I, come on. Well, I don't want to. It's not about that. It's my it's pizza nice. fund. <laughs> it's their pizza fund too. Well, it, everyone's their pizza fund. Is my pizza fun? And that's everyone's pizza fun. Yeah. Mm, I was wondering how you're going to work that in, yeah. The older I get, the more the government doesn't make sense to me. We've established already that I'm old. (laughs) But every time I pay tax, I think about it for like six months. I have like a six-month period where I'm like, they get this much of every dollar I make? Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, taxation is slavery, and we shouldn't have driver's licenses either. Right, yeah. (laughs) Personally, I think you should... I don't want to be on the road with a bunch of maniacs. Boo. (laughs) Boo! Boo this man! Ooh! 
Oh, Avu, we fucking uh, no, no, we made it. That's a good one. Oh, did somebody <laughs> did somebody bought me a gift subscription? Yep. All right. Welcome. I'm never gonna us. complain about taxes ever again because it go. turns out I do get a lot of free stuff. Taxation is that the rule like, about half of channel? Thing though, it's a good system, right? What what's the rule? That you can't complain about taxes. That's the thing. If, you, if you're subscribed to Hoffa, you can't complain about taxes. Dude, that's well, nice. yeah, it's not. No, you guys don't watch the news, I guess. Uh, I don't watch the nudes. Did you see the news this weekend that Jeff Bezos was making uh, two hundred and thirty thousand dollars a minute? That's it. That, honestly, <laughs> that's what I said. <laughs> but can you imagine, like? I was thinking about it, and of course everybody was like, this is unacceptable. And I read the article and I went, that's fucking sweet. Like, dude, first off, that sucks. But also, congratulations, that's an unbelievable number. But I was like, if somebody cuts in front of me in traffic, it's a wash. Uh, yeah, I knife them. Well, okay, I mean, I don't live in America. But, uh, I was like, if somebody cuts in front of Jeff Bezos in traffic, or, like, his flight's delayed by 15 minutes, that's, like, he a three million dollar delay in his time. Like, yeah. is it? No, he still makes the money. Yeah, he's still getting the money. Like, yeah. Jeff Bezos, that that's a very good point. Yeah. Well, on, on a similar vein, there was, like, a they did the math post mm. of, like, um, like, like, it was, like, how much money would have to be on the ground for you to actually go out of your way and stop and pick it up? Yeah. Like, like a quarter, maybe? Like, uh, maybe I, like if I dropped, cents? if I dropped a penny, which we don't even have anymore. I was gonna anymore, say, I'd pick up pennies. I'd pick it up, yeah. Really? Not because I would. Find a penny, pick it up. It, All day it's, have first off, there's the rhyme, mm. which you have to be beholden Busta. to. Busta rhymes. Secondly, um, I would, I would pick it up because a penny is garbage. So like, I wouldn't. I, no, that's like if I, you dropped I, I, that you you're littering, man. Trash. You're you're littering. Pennies are trash. You're littering. Pennies are pretty much. Yeah. Oh. That's, pretty it, that's much. like if you dropped a potato chip bag on the ground, you would just be like, oh, it's gone now. It belongs I'm more to the inclined earth. I'm to pick up a potato bag, chip <laughs> bag from the ground than I am to pick up a penny from the ground. Well, so the, anyway, there there was a they did the math post on like Bill Gates yeah. and like how much like that would be equivalent. Yeah, to Yeah, versus him. Michael Jordan, right? I've seen that. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That. Yeah. So it's like if and, it's gonna yeah. cost him like ten seconds to pick it up. So how much does he make every ten seconds? Yeah, something like that. Okay. Yeah. So I mean, like he like at the at, like on the post, it was like something like like it would be as if he dropped like ten thousand dollars on the ground. Only then would it be worth it for him to pick it up. It's pretty amazing. I don't. Yeah, really, like, that doesn't make any sense to me. It's not like, what? But I mean, can you imagine Bill Gates dropping, like a box, <laughs> uh, like nine thousand nine hundred dollars on the ground, and then being like, eh? I think I'll just <laughs> let it go. <laughs> How does it work? Explain it. Well, you know, if you time? make, if you're worth X amount of money and you make X amount of money per day, then if you drop some money on the ground. Is it even worth your time to pick it up if you dropped less than you would make in the time it takes to pick it up? But it's what am not I like doing? every time what he makes an action, time he makes more money. That. It's not like if he doesn't pick it up, he'll make more money. Correct. It's yeah. more like like if it's if yeah. it's if it's like uh, if it's something that he would care about. Like if my job in this instant was like if I'm not. Moving my leg, or yeah, if I'm not moving my legs, moving I'm not making my legs. Yeah, right? moving my legs, moving my <laughs> arms. What are you? What yeah. are you talking about here? But like, these people, like they just, they don't have to do shit. Like whether they're in a boardroom or like whether they got, I don't know. Whether they're in the like, boardroom or the bedroom. In their ass, it doesn't matter. Yeah, they're making money. Josh, these people is very insulting. It's they extremely... prefer the term. Yeah, they prefer the term wealth affected. Humans, <laughs> so. Dude, I, I worked it. with a guy when I lived in Korea, and I don't even know... What's the statute of limitations on, like, the average felony? Twelve. Just twelve. Just yeah. the number <laughs> The number twelve is the statute <laughs> of limitations. <laughs> Alright. Okay, well, one second. The music's too loud. Thanks a lot, Mozart. Um, Why is there a baby head? Uh, because it's, know, it's scary. It. Mm -hmm. uh. It's also, like, it's bobbing <laughs> up and down. What are you listening to, right? It's Ina Klein and Knock music. What's that mean? Uh, a little bit of night music. What? Mm. I don't speak German. This is like the one German phrase I know because of this piece. Uh. Anyway, the, the dude I worked with in Korea, not only would he not pick up money if he dropped it on the ground, he threw out anything that was a dime or under. 
the equivalent in Korean currency. Yeah, so screw it. That's, my, in, that's what absolutely. I mean. In the garbage. Yeah. Throw it away. It's all trash. No, but you can't. That's like an actual crime. No, that's like who gives a shit? That's methodically destroying currency. All right, yeah. yeah. Fucking get over here. Arrest my ass. I'm not saying you're going to get arrested, but you might. The cops might come and be like, "Hey, stop throwing yeah, all, all these all dimes." These nickels in the, in the trash, Josh. I don't know who fucking cares. Get out of here. <laughs> Do you throw your money in the trash? I might as well. <laughs> <laughs> that's a fair point. Yeah. I do that, my dude. Don't throw out the money. Just put it in a jar you go, and then take. You go to jail. Why? I guarantee. I. I. This is. You I, guarantee. I've been doing this. You're not gonna go to jail. I'm not gonna guarantee yeah, that. Go but jail, yeah. I. I've been doing this show for so long. I guarantee. I'm gonna be like, why don't you just save it and put it in a coin star? And then people are gonna be like, well, they take like thirty percent. So you'd rather. Yeah. And this is a straw man for now until it becomes reality. But you'd rather yeah. throw the money in the trash than give coin star their cut. Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah. Havu, this is the kind of show that you're on right now. <laughs> what, what, what have they done for me? So, like, here's the thing. Like, I fucking... Coinstar's stupid. Yes. And what I loved in, like, the most entire thing in my entire life, I loved it the most, was I had a bank, and the bank sense. had a fucking money machine, mm. and they didn't take anything. And then, uh, like, the mm. bank started getting rid of them because the people were like, ah, they didn't give me the exact right fucking number of monies that I put in there. I'm like... My dude, it's like the convenience fee. Fuck yeah, that. Exactly. Like, if they're wrong by a little bit, at least they're not taking it off the top. Then, like, maybe they're off just by a little bit. I'm not counting my money, then putting in the goddamn money machine. To make sure it gets dude. the right amount. Exactly, <laughs> yeah. What, what if fuck? What if Coinstar took 30% and they were wrong? Ooh, about there you number? go. Wait, yeah. Coinstar takes 30%? Apparently they take 10, and I was exaggerating, but... <laughs> no. I was like, I don't think anyone would do that for 30%. Do you guys that ever... Did, absurd amount, yeah. you ever have the machine as a kid where, like, you'd pour a bunch of coins into the top of it, and then based on their width, <laughs> they would sort into columns of, like, this grandma is a quarter... Did. Yeah, say, that's how I learned about it. My grandma was like, hey, it's no, time you to... You said this is your... You said, like, it was your machine. Oh, yeah, like, I went in a time machine like and I you... bought one. Nobody is making that machine anymore because Coinstar exists. I would, But machine. as a kid, I loved using it. You'd be like, oh, it's time to count the, the change. You'd get out this weird primitive machine from, like, the year 1800 and then yeah. start sorting it. And you'd go to the bank with, a you know, 18 rolls of quarters and be like, here's $4. Yeah. It's a great tip calculator. <laughs> it's a Seinfeld. Sein yeah, yeah. Seinfeld it's joke, a Seinfeld yeah. reference. I don't get it. That coin sorter is still sold. Well, That's you know, weird. more power to you. I don't know what happens yeah. to my coins. What do you mean? I, I don't use cash very often. Yeah. Okay. When I get... Because we have $2 coins and $1 coins. When I get $2 coins, when we get loonies and toonies, I save them and I pay for parking. The quarters and Pocket. dimes and nickels, I just give them to Kate. And then I never see she him again. Coin star. Uh, we don't have Coinstar here. Coin star. She goes to... This, I, I hate this She one. goes to La Coin Stare. <laughs> so she goes to, yep, uh, that's she how goes French works. <laughs> 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 Dude, Canadian money remember, is sick. We got we've got uh, a remember, vertical ten dollar bill now. I remember going to the Kush Tart. That was cool. <laughs> the the Kush Tart? Yeah, that's it's yeah. actually the largest. That wasn't that bad. I won. It's the largest nice. convenience store. I came in last. <laughs> Hopper, Hopper, you had the most points. Most points. Most points. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> what is exactly, that? Yeah. <laughs> we don't do Twilight that much. Maybe. Oh, that's a shame. Ooh. You ever played Twilight Imperium? Guys. Is that how that game? No, I haven't played Twilight Imperium. I'm an adult. <laughs> it's a board game. Yeah. Um, okay, it so... It takes like 12 hours to beat. Roll them back a second. Yeah. Why do you have vertical currency? So... Vertical currency. I want to... There's a couple of things I want to bring up. One is... Okay. All money is also vertical. It really just depends on the way well, you hold it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> But like, why not? But it's red horizontally. No, it's actually what purple because it's about? a ten dollar bill. Red horizontally. Oh, we're yeah. In. Whose head is an ice cream cone? That's Rob's. That is. Uh, well, it's actually a unicorn horn. Well, whatever. It's just a. It, that's it, a. I thought it was ice cream. That's a non-vegan ice cream cone. 
I went to a vegan restaurant this weekend. Yeah. Uh-huh. Hated it. <laughs> well, what would you get? I got a, uh, it was called like the ultimate sandwich or something like that. Classic mistake. Uh, yeah. No so, vegan restaurant is ever going to have any sandwich described as ultimate. Yeah, maybe it was like this. No, it was a special. It was the special sandwich. Okay. And so it was like apple and then like vegetable guts between like two <laughs> pieces of bread. It wasn't that good. Vegetable guts. Yeah. yeah so- it's like, you know, when they have, like, a vegetable, like, patty, but it's, like, not really, like, formed like a patty. Oh, so it's just, it like, is. It's like, like some kind of, like, mushroom sort of I d- I don't know. Here, let me see if I can find it. Yeah, you find it uh, uh, just out the restaurant for being bad <laughs> live on camera. You go to the restaurant unless you want me to. Hafu, what's your tolerance uh, for vegetarian cuisine? Very low. Really? I like cheese and meat and bread. I feel like I should yeah. just You can and- still eat bread. Oh. Uh, and cheese, yes. right? Yeah. Oh, wait, but you can't be vegan and eat. You cheese. can't eat. You can't, you can't eat vegan cheese. I don't know how they give out give out you cheese. You can't eat cake either, right? Uh, I mean, there is usually they have vegan cakes. Yeah, there's usually vegan. eggs, but I'm sure you can make a vegan cake. Uh, they have yeah. like uh, they have vegan cakes. The special sandwich is veg pate. Yeah. Which is oh. vegetable guts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How do you? I'm just Smoked watching you. Smoked apple and, and chilies <laughs> plus red cabbage slaw <laughs> oh. plus. Salt, pickled, turnip, plus savory sauce. Like, I gotta be honest with you. I really like vegetarian cuisine. If I went to a vegetarian restaurant and they were like, do you want the sandwich? Yeah, hell no. Why? Sandwiches are fucking amazing. Vegetarian, like, my favorite food. vegetarian and vegan sandwiches, they just don't have the same sort of... Like, there's, no po- there's no appeal to them it's for me yeah. you can, if you can get like, you know, something made with chickpeas or like an awesome soup or something like that. They had, awful, but they had some decent pierogies. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a good one. Oh, pierogies are good. Yeah. Pierogies yeah. are... Oh, amazing. I almost did it! <laughs> pierogies are amazing. Pierogies no, are damn near the, the, the best uh, things ever made. Kielbasa with it. Kielbasa yeah, is great. You would, you would have to choose yeah. not to have kielbasa. That's a shame. But then, like, yeah, I'm, I'm also meat. an expert on vegetarian sandwiches, because when I was in my first year of college, we used to get chicken sandwiches, and then when they would wrap them up, we would just tell the cashier that they were hummus to save a dollar each time. So you're, you're talking to a bona fide expert right here. A bona fide thief? L- hey, like, that was 12 years ago. That's the statute of limitations. <laughs> <laughs> I'm safe. <laughs> but, uh, well, like, Coffee. Kate and I went to a, a veg. How did you guys make that? It was, like, the easiest thing. We went oh. to a, uh, a vegetarian see. restaurant just, a couple months ago. And then uh-huh. I had. Uh, was it vegetarian or vegan? It was oh vegan. My God. But I had. Uh, I was vegan. Yeah. I had vegan poutine, poutine, and I was like, "It's okay," but obviously. What what they substitute for cheese? I have no idea. It's a vegan cheese, I guess. And uh, what the fuck is a vegan cheese, dude. I have no idea, but I. My friend. Okay, I'm vegan. in the middle of a story here, and there's like <laughs> a there's a beat to it, and then there's a punchline at the end. So oh, okay. Uh, Go. So I had vegetarian poutine. It was okay, by which I mean it was. Not good, but it wasn't like disgusting. And then Kate had a vegan hot dog, and she's like, "You should take a bite of it." And I did, and I was like, "That's not right. <laughs> That's just the poutine is like a reasonable approximation. The hot dog was just like, please use that vegetable matter for some other no, purpose." No, there's Dude. a second hole. <laughs> Dude, I want to actually. Speaking of vegetarian things, you guys heard about the uh, the Impossible Burger? Thing? Yes. No. I want to try that really the bad. The Impossible is. Burger is, is a, a meat substitute burger, so it's not real meat, but it's supposed to taste the closest to the real thing. Okay. Yeah. Mike like Bittel had one. Like I saw on Twitter. Blood and everything. Yeah, it has like ferrous compounds or something so, that are supposed to mimic the taste of blood, which I wanted to tell him like. Ew. That's not what burgers are like, but I didn't want to ruin their whole like marketing thing that they had going on. <laughs> like when you bite into a, a juicy burger, you're not like, oh wait, yeah. Wait, when you bite into blood. the ju- wait, that's the flavor of blood. I don't, I don't think so. Wait, what are you talking about? I didn't make the Impossible Burger, Hafu. Here's <laughs> here's my thing. I I just want to know, would vegans eat cheese that was human cheese? No. <laughs> Why? Because it comes from an animal. But yeah, but like if there was a consenting human person being like, yeah, please milk me. Mm. Take my <laughs> Please like, milk me. 
<laughs> you shouldn't have. You shouldn't have said a, that. That's a clip right there. <laughs> that's what that is. Why not? <laughs> it's a valid question. I don't know if. Is it? I, and like my my vegan friend, she like had to pause. She's like, I don't know. Yeah. I'm like, there you go. Well, I think it's like less. Would vegans eat it? And more like you'd have to ask on like an individual level, right? Because it depends yeah, why I, you're vegan. Are you vegan because you think that animals are treated unethically or are you vegan? Yes. Okay, well, if you're right, vegan because right, of that, right. I think a consensual human milking should yeah, make human right. cheese a, a vegan appropriate food. <laughs> but you kind of need a new label because it's not really vegan. It's an animal why? product. Yeah, yeah, but like, I guess, eh, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe just vegans, maybe that just needs to only be for, for you know just finish my sentence for me i think what josh is trying all. to say is that vegan can just be a label for acceptable foods not necessarily foods that are uh, don't come from animals yeah. yeah 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 so like it should it, it can only be described as vegan if like the animal doesn't consent if it's a consenting animal, then it's okay. Is it's still vegan. it vegan to eat human cheese if the milk came from someone that I think is such a terrible person <laughs> that they're not even a human being? Like, they've foregone that level. Dude. What? They can't, because that's just fucking... What if they're, like, a really, really shitty person, though? Like me? Yeah, yeah. Like, what if it was Josh's milk? Dude, and you were I like, bet there would be a line for my milk. <laughs> you think so? What if the what if the <laughs> yeah. milk, what if the milk came from someone who ate meat? Would that change things? Jeez. That oh. would maybe change things. What if the milk came from so, someone who is meat? <laughs> I'm meat. We're all meat. <laughs> so, it, so then, secondary question: Vegans? Yeah. <laughs> would you would you eat a Venus flytrap then? Um. Yes. Uh, <laughs> all right. Because it's a. Here, I, we by the out. way, <laughs> and this is this is before you were on the show, Hafu. But we had a talk about this a couple of years ago. Maybe everybody made fun of me because yeah. I didn't know that deers were herbivores. Deers. I didn't know that deer were herbivorous. Does that is that better, Mr. Professor? I didn't know that deer were herbivorous. Thank you. Um, yeah, that's better. Despite holding the highest degree possible in biology, which is a bachelor's from right. a Canadian university. And um, everyone was like, this guy doesn't even know uh, deer are herbivorous. Looked it up this weekend. They're not herbivorous. They're, <laughs> they're omnivores. But they don't get much opportunity to eat animals. But if an animal, like, pops into their sphere of influence, they'll just fucking go to town. Like, they'll eat a bird. They'll eat, like, a, a newly hatched chick. They'll yeah, eat they meat. Don't. They yeah. just don't get an opportunity to eat meat very often. Welcome to my fucking world. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like I've been holding the grudge for two years waiting for this, like, you know, TIL to come out, but... <laughs> Yeah, well, I mean, I, I've mentioned this on the show before, too, but I did see that one gif of that cow eating a baby Yeah, bird. dude, it's it's really what? sad because you're like... Yeah, it's very sad. It reminds yeah. you that, like, nature is all about survival. It's like this, you're like, oh, what a cute newly hatched life form, wow. And now it's It it's just gone. got eaten by that bovine. Yeah, yeah. and now I'm going to eat that cow, probably, like, probably not that yeah. specific yeah, like... cow, but, like, when you think about it, sort of. <laughs> Might as well be. Could be. I mean, it's possible. Unlikely. Like, even, I'm cognizant of that, even though our cats are obviously, like, domesticated and babies, more or less. I'm like, if we go away for three or four days, and they turn over the water dish or the food dish on the first day, we might come back to one of them being dead. Like, not, <laughs> yeah. not from starving to death, but they might just turn on each other. Yeah? You should teach them how to use the faucet. <laughs> <laughs> Would you ever take your... Cats on a walk, like if you had a harness. I have done I've it. I've seen people do that. You've yeah. done it. You've done it. <laughs> really? How? What? How'd it go? Um, badly. 
Kristen won't let me do it. Okay, so like, I think it depends on the cat. But yeah. we took Ruka outside before we had Tomo. And yeah. uh, he's so curious. Whenever we open the apartment door, he tries to like escape into the wilderness, right? Like, yeah. that he thinks that he'd fare well out there. We took him outside on a harness and he spent the whole time being so low to the ground and like afraid of everything. And then we walked Aww. him near, like there's a park relatively close by that like opens onto the beach and he tried to burrow under the fence of the park and like escape again into the great wide open yeah there was like a beehive back there and a bunch of bees or wasps i'm not sure which one because we've established i don't know anything about animals to begin with like <laughs> he was he was freaking out he basically had like a panic attack out there and we haven't yeah. done it Aww. since hmm. what the fucking invisible wall come on all right, now, if Kristen ever asks you, tell her that it was a great idea. And you, you need to do it all the time. <laughs> well, I don't think it's wrong to, like, you know, you do it once or something like that and then see how it works. Yeah? Yeah. Maybe they'd love it. I'm taking Lady Grey but out. But Ruka did not love it. Yeah. He got, he got Dennis... real scared. <laughs> so my friend Dennis has two cats. They basically have an entire, like, like pretty much like an apartment space to themselves. Yeah. Because like he has like um, he's he's got like a like a duplex basically, and the downstairs is just basically his office. But he doesn't let the cats upstairs, so they just have their own house basically. That's pretty sick. Yeah, in New York. Oh my. Yeah, God. where there's like you know, Concrete maybe like two hundred thousand homeless people. <laughs> he's got yep. he's got a little part of his house that's just for cats. Cats, cats got a house. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's pretty sick. Yeah. It's like, it's really cool, I think. <laughs> How that worked out. Oh my god. <laughs> Capitalism, am I right? <laughs> you know, they're like, um, these backpacks that cats, you can, it's like astronaut cat suits or something. I'm gonna blow your mind. Huh? We got two of them. What? You actually, look! <laughs> yep. We, can you link me to them? We have the... I saw it on Anna Akana's. Oh, yeah, videos. yeah. We, we have... Whatever the, I think it's the knockoff version of those, because I was like, I'm not paying a hundred dollars for a cat carrier. <laughs> um, so yeah, we we have we have one of those for each of the cats. Do you How'd use them? Go? They love them. Really? <laughs> Absolutely. And they're so much easier to carry. Like sometimes, if we're going to the. How did you not bring this up? Well, it... I feel like this is a perfect segue to I have astronaut backpacks in my cat. <laughs> well, you know, my whole life is anecdotes, so sometimes <laughs> I forget. Someone link me to these these magical creature carriers on yeah, my. Yeah, oh. I'm not sure I understand what. They okay, are. it's a backpack, like... but yeah, in the front. Yeah, the oh. the the backpack has like a bulb, like a dome, similar to an is astronaut's hat. Is it like a hard hat. backpack? Or is it a it's a hard backpack. backpack. <gasps> it's kind of interesting. And then it's really nice because sometimes like either Kate or myself ends up taking both cats to the vet or to get groomed or whatever. It's much easier to carry two cats, and Ruka's getting a little heavy, so even more so. Uh, when, Ruka, are you being tubby, kitty? When you can have, like, one on your back and then just carry the other one in your hands. But <laughs> I just saw a picture of it! It's, oh, my God! It's sweet. That's hilarious looking. Mm. But it's, oh, it's was... also, like... It sounds wrong, but people love seeing it. So they always want to take photos, but every time the cats are outside, they're distressed. Like, we had a fire yeah. drill, and the alarm is, like, crazy loud. So the cats are freaking out. We shove them into the backpacks, and we go downstairs, and they're, like, so scared. And everyone's going, oh, that's so cute, oh! Like, pointing and, like, tapping on the dome. And, like, can we take a photo? And I guess, like... It's not like I can ask the cat if you can take a photo, so sure, go for it, and then... I want that. They love looking out, though. Like, when they come back from an appointment, they're like, this is the life. That sounds... <laughs> I want that. I want that in my house. <laughs> What's for out the house? Yeah, you, you wouldn't use it in the house. I'm, no, I want it in my house. So you so can like, take it out. I can out take it out. Nice. Have Very you good. tried the tape? The square tape thing. Square? Oh, like if you leave just a square of tape, they'll sit in it. Yeah. I have. What? Really? Yeah. Cats. They're, they're weird. Wait, you've done that? <laughs> I've never done creatures. it. No. Nor, yeah. nor have I done the one that's like, 
when your cat's facing in one direction, you put like a cucumber behind them and then uh, like alert them. And then when they look around, they think it's a snake or something and they freak out. <laughs> it's another one I have not done. What I have done is like anytime we have citrus and I'm eating it, just like bring my hand close to the cat's face and it sniffs it and it goes like, oh, what's that? It smells interesting. And then immediately it's like, that's poison. <laughs> and I hate it. <laughs> Stupid cats. They're, they're oh, silly please. creatures. No. Yeah. Why am I still here? I am just going to say <gasps> I like cats. I'm yeah. much more of a dog man, nope. to be honest. Me too. Yeah. You're a dog man? <laughs> <laughs> you know, we know one of those. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I, I've had cats like almost my whole life, so I'm a cat person. But I do find, I think, dogs smell worse. Yeah. Uh, yes. It depends on the dog. Yeah. Like if it like, my my cousin, she's got like the greatest dog of all time. It's like this. Is it tiny is little it Chihuahua? No. Grumpy boo. cat. Majin Boo. Boo! No, no, no. It's, a, it's a it's a little Chihuahua, but like it's such a great dog. Like it's tiny, so you don't have to like worry about like its giant poops and shit. Yeah. Um, and then like it it stands. never barks, which is also really cool. Yeah. Um, yeah, and it's just a really cute dog. Dude, I know. I like it's it. like an internet. I don't want to say meme, but it, the, it's a dog that's extremely popular on the internet. But yeah, it, ooh. that's a Shiba well, Inu. It, that's what I was gonna say. Every time I see a Shiba yeah. Inu, ah. I'm like. I want a dog. I want that dog yeah. specifically. Yeah, yeah, specifically that. I have that. never yeah. seen like I see some dogs in public, and I'm like, yeah, I bet the owner loves that dog, but I don't feel anything for it in particular. And when I see yeah. a Shiba Inu, I'm like, I want your dog. Mm. <laughs> Apparently, like, like I've I've mentioned this on my own stream. Like, I would I would like a Shiba. Like, it seems like a pretty decent sized apartment dog. Yeah, you know, um, and. Uh, but people have told me that like, it's basically like having a cat. Oh, like, let's go! Yeah, <laughs> ideal. They have, apparently, they have different temperaments than than like regular dogs. But yeah, I don't know. I don't think I've ever seen a Shiba in person. Really? That might be a lie. I've not think I've ever seen one. They're out of control here. Really? They're, they're everywhere. Are they like well behaved? I I mean I've never seen one lose it, but. <laughs> I don't know. That's I've good. never been outside that's and been good. like, man, that's a bad Shiba Inu. They're always just walking around with their tail up, you know, having a good time. Yeah, they're not like barking at you no. and stuff, being like bad and stupid and stuff. No. I mean, because everyone loves them, right? So what are they going to be sad about? Yeah. Well, I, get, all right. Like, so there's plenty there of dogs the out there that are like, are like super cool and like cute, but then they'll bark their heads off. Yeah. 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 Like you ever see like, a Shiba Inu and it has like a like a bandana on? Yeah. Dude, that's I need that dog. It's adorable. Yeah, it's very <laughs> it's very cute. See any other dog wearing a bandana, I'm like, yeah, whatever. Unless it's like an English bulldog or something and it's in a motorcycle sidecar. Are cool. Yeah. yeah. I'm like you know, I'm down you know with what, that. You know why I think I like dogs is cuz like 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 more than cats anyway is cuz cats remind me too much of myself. Mm, okay. How so? Like, they're they're like they're like lethargic all the time and they don't really give a shit about anything. And they're just like they're constantly bored. Yeah. That. Whereas a dog, like if you just say a word, he'll be the most excited he's ever yeah, been that's in true. his entire life, and that's just so much fun. But that's like that's that's almost like too much. That. That's like I think wild. about that, I'm just like, ah, oh, god, like, yeah, calm down a little bit. You know what I like <laughs> when? Uh, <laughs> like I got I got worn out by just you saying that. When dogs get excited <laughs> and they like smack their paws on the ground. Like, yeah. that's my dude right there. And you, Rob was right. All you have to do is go like, oh, who's a good dog? Yeah, right. And the dog is like, <laughs> okay, it's on. <laughs> oh, I get to be excited? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, the dogs are great. Oh. Yeah, dogs I want are a cool. German Shepherd really nope. bad. Nope, absolutely not. What? what? <laughs> you want, like, a police dog? <laughs> German Shepherds are beautiful dogs. They are really, really pretty. All my experience has been barking all the time. Mm. Really? Not into that. I mean, have yes. you had one? Nope. Well, then how do you know? Because yeah. I've been around. <laughs> <laughs> Dennis has 
Jesus had two German shepherds, and I they neither of them ever barked. Plus, One if fight. anyone ever comes into your apartment and they smell like narcotics, they'll tackle them to the ground and physically restrain them until an officer comes. Right, exactly, yeah. Is that true? Yeah, all German shepherds are, <laughs> by default, police dogs. Mm -hmm. oh. And they can all smell they drugs. They can all smell drugs, right? That's what they were bred originally bred uh, by uh, mm -hmm. Pablo Escobar to see if his employees were stealing product. Most people don't know that. He called them mm -hmm. German shepherds to throw people off the scent, ironically enough. Right, they were Colombian They were people. actually Colombian dogs. Hi. Mm -hmm. Oh. Bush Mastiff. Let's yeah, see I didn't Bush know Mastiff that. Look, look again. Uh, that's one of those British dogs that's like really tall and thin. Oh yeah, it's the one with the floppy face. <laughs> they all have floppy faces. Mm. That's true, but he has an especially floppy face. I also dogs like I like to I, look at, but never want to own. I'm starting to feel like Pomeranian is in that camp. Oh yeah, no, nope. Th those are barkers. Those they'll they bark. bark they yeah. won't yeah, shut up. I've lived with four of them. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> my with Jenna Bella, she would go to work and then I'd stream. None of them watch the dogs, and they're just crazy. <laughs> they're so crazy. They're so little. I don't know how to make so much noise. But when they they're get so groomed, all the time. and they're like, their head is like a cotton ball. That's yeah. a good looking they're, dog. They're really cute. They're, they're really cute. But uh, I did a 24 hour stream for Christmas, and um, I was in like hour 18, and then they all like went out to go watch a movie. And the dogs? they all left their the dogs. dogs. <laughs> yeah, the dog. No, what no, did no. they see? Yeah. Jenna, Jenna, and her 101 family. Dalmatians. Oh. <laughs> they left Lady eight the dogs with me. And they left eight dogs. I'm like, hour 18 into this 24 hour stream. And yeah. they each bark in succession. It's like, ruff, 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 ruff. like, <laughs> non stop. And I videotaped it and sent it to Jenna. I was like, you cannot do this to me. It was like, wow. eight dogs. I was like, that's, what do you want me to that's do? A lot of dogs. None of these are my dogs. That's I didn't crazy. sign up for this. I'll, I'll babysit like two dogs. Eight. I used like, to live. Oh, like, my old roommate had a dog, Hudson. Um, oh, that's a good name. That's a good a name for a dog. Yeah. It was. Yeah. It was a, a really good dog. I liked this dog, but before like he brought Hudson into the apartment, I had to talk Wait, to him. Wait, is like, the dog is named Hudson or is your roommate named Hudson? Because I'm getting my, a weird. My kinda... roommate's name was Scott. Because I'm, I'm getting, like, a picture of this dog walking a human on a leash, and he just comes into the apartment, and you're like, hey, Hudson, and you're like, hello, Josh. <laughs> I like that a lot. Dog roommate so, coming this fall on ABC. You remember that one time that you heard, like, that dog in the background? It was like, <laughs> That was Hudson. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Oh. That's a good joke. Oh, yeah. He had like severe neurological disorders. Yeah. Like that. Oh. I'm not laughing at the dog. I'm laughing at the memory of the sound. Oh. So, but before like he brought Hudson into our lives, into the home, I was like, listen, man, I am not taking this dog out ever. I will not clean up after it. I won't take it out on walks. And he's like, that's cool, dude. I got you. And I never had to, and it was amazing. Hey, I love yeah. that. Yeah. So it, it was. Go. It was the best. Oh, okay, fuck this level. This this is a classic <laughs> if, little. If like, I lived with a roommate, and chef. they're like, "Hey, can you take care of my eight dogs?" I would just be like, well, dude, "Fuck no." Did I ever tell you you, you you were you've been to my or you went to my college house? Um, no, I didn't. You probably did. You knew no, each other in college. I swear. Oh, I, no, we've I known did. each other oh. since like tenth grade. <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit. Yeah, we, we um, go way back. This is, this is a kind of friendship you can only have if you've known somebody <laughs> for this long. But uh, we... We're best friends now. In, in my second year of college, I lived with five other guys and a girl. And then one day, uh, the girl, who does have a name, but I don't want to give it out. I just wanted to... We, I didn't, we didn't call her that, is all I'm trying to yeah, say. Yeah, you called her woman. She, no, we, we called her her name, which I'm not going to say, but because it's a funny name. But um, she came home and she was like, would you guys be cool if I got a dog? And we're like, are you fucking crazy? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we're seven 19 year olds living in like a slum house and we're students and you want to buy a dog? <laughs> and she was like real sad about it. But we did like the Aww. absolute, it was the right thing. 
<laughs> we could have we could have yeah. been nicer in our rejection of it, but no. The dog would have been had, way too high. To be firm. Yeah, we were like, and she's in class like ten hours a day. Mm -hmm. we're, we're like, I'm, uh, I'm not gonna take yeah. this dog out. I don't. Well, I mean, I would. <laughs> I would. I would. I would. I was. Uh, I, I went to college in the Netherlands, so we talk like that. <laughs> I would. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I would take the dog out for walks, but I don't want to. Right. Yeah. But if I was the only one home, I'd be like, fine, I'll take the dog out for a walk. Nope. Not even Jess's, that. Uh, Jess's dog always looks like so suspicious. What kind of dog like, is it? Um, well, it's kind of like just a, like a mutt. It's like a okay, mix of a million yeah. things here. I, I linked a picture of it in, in chat. I'll put it in Discord. Oh my, I'm so bad at kids, man. This guy's a little <laughs> tricky. Look how suspicious he looks. That's him like constantly when he was looking backwards. It's how did you get across it? I'm scrolling down here. Oh, I've missed a lot of messages. Oh. Yeah. Okay. It's a suspicious looking dog. Right. He d he is looking What's at you that? like he's waiting Wait, for the he's waiting no, for the shoe to drop. Mhm. Mm he's a good yeah. dog. He's a cute dog. Yeah. He's a good boy. He's a bit bark. I don't like Barky. Get it out of here. Barky's for trees, not dogs. <laughs> what do you guys think of corgis? I don't want to speak for anybody else. I'm for them. Yeah, yeah I, I like corgis. Yeah. They're, they're so fine. cute. I got, I got friends with corgis. They're pretty good. Did you that see... Uh, like a, yeah. There was a the Garth Brooks song? <laughs> <laughs> I got yeah. friends with low bellies. Um, <laughs> <laughs> there was that... Uh, there's this corgi account on Instagram or Twitter... I, I, I saw it on Twitter, and then they were like, hey, it's my corgi at the vet, and then somebody posted and they said, the corgi is extremely obese, it's very sad, and they just went off on them with like a litany <laughs> of profanities, and we're like, excuse me, bitch, first off, nobody asked her opinion, second, the American Veterinary Association says that like the healthiest weight for a corgi is between 3.5 and 4.1 kilograms, and he's 3.6 kilograms, so if I want your opinion, I'll go to the garbage dump that you came from and go get it. I was like, this is so good. That's really Because we get the same That's thing, fantastic. like on the... Whenever we do anything with our cats on video, people are like, oh, you shouldn't do that. That's uh, right. But that's just, that's just people yeah. in general, yeah. you know? I tweeted that I like streamed, or I slept 18 hours, and I know it's not healthy, but you know, there's always that person who's like, sleeping more than 12 hours is not good for you. <laughs> or, like, anytime I have a Red Bull, it's like, oh, you're gonna die from that. It's like, well, I fucking sit and stream for 17 hours, but you don't complain about that. Yeah. Actually, some people do complain yeah. about that. Yeah. P people go a little hard in the paint with like animals, like, it, it's it because look like like yeah you shouldn't treat your animals poorly like in general of course, right yeah. and there are certain things that you shouldn't do of course I don't know but like there are there are some times where no I mean that's definitely true but like there are people like on YouTube it's like this is killing the dog this is a monstrous act and it's like a guy just like hugging his dog well did I tell you like yeah. Well, first off, if it's not your pet, every look that the pet gives, someone will misinterpret as fear. They'll yeah. be like, you come home, and you're like, Ruka! And they're like, look at his eyes. He's so afraid of the loud noise you just made. <laughs> and there's a gr One of my all-time favorite videos on YouTube is, like, this dude walks into his kitchen, and there's just a lynx in his kitchen. Like a mountain <laughs> lynx. A wild yeah. creature. And yeah. Yeah. the lynx is like... And then the dude is mocking it, which is probably not okay. <laughs> but he he's going, Rrr! and then the lynx is like, Rrr! he gets like really mad. People are like, this poor lynx, he, this poor buddy is so terrified. There's a wild animal in this dude's kitchen, and people are acting like he kidnapped it and is like abusing it. Get out of the kitchen. <laughs> Also, people like greatly underestimate a dog's resilience. Like, there, my, my, I had, um, my grandpa had a dog once, and you couldn't leave pencils on the ground because he'll just, he'd just eat the whole fucking thing. He'll just eat lead, <laughs> the, the metal bit, the eraser. He'd just eat it all, and he'd be fine. Like, he would be absolutely okay with that. Yeah. But you couldn't, you couldn't leave it around him. He loved pencils. Well, that's, like, <laughs> you have no idea how many times I've saved these cats from eating, like, a screw or, like, their own hair. Why even. do you just have screws? Well, I mean, we, instead of, I got <laughs> friends in screws. I was, 
place. Is- Kate and I, uh, we, we ordered some furniture, and we didn't expect it to arrive today, but it did. <laughs> so we spent the afternoon building some shelves. And there's screws, you know, it's just like detritus around when you're building this stuff. And then you just hear like, ding, 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 ding. And then you look, and the cat's stolen a screw, and it's trying to put it in its mouth. And you're like, okay, if... What would you do if I was not here to stop you from eating a, a sharp piece of metal? Yeah. Like yes. poisonous flowers or like, uh, you know, when I grind coffee, it a little bit spills. They jump up on the counter and try to lick it. Like caffeine and coffee grinds are like literally poisonous for cats. You're like, okay, genius. <laughs> yeah. I did, by the way, we can talk about this in the second segment. I did break one of the shelves of the two that we bought. What happened? Oh no! I tried to. Fl- oh, you're talking about. Well, no, second. it's okay. Uh, are you sure? Well, I mean, like, it's a, we can hold it. You know, they're symmetric. Shelves are symmetric, and I flipped right. it over, and the only thing holding it together was like these. It's my fault. It's but my fault. <laughs> okay. The piece that was holding it together is like this cheap plastic peg, and when I flipped it over, it like bent and then snapped in half. So. Mm. It's like one one of the shelves is super broken. The other one is beautiful. What are you gonna put on the shelves? We have shelves right now, um, and we're just replacing those ones. The honest what, answer what, what the shelves. That's we just not built. what he asked. Okay, we're gonna yeah. put all the fucking Kiati Mundi figurines that we got sent in the mail on. Them. Are you actually? Because like you might need to. We they're already on a shelf. We're just gonna transition them from their current shelf onto another shelf. You literally have a Kiati Mundi shelf. Yeah. That's. <laughs> One of the best things I've ever heard of. If my you answer. came over to my apartment, there is a shelf that has like eight Kiati Mundi action figures on it. <laughs> I didn't buy any of them. What's that Kiati Mundi? Kiati Mundi. Have you seen the Star Wars no. uh, prequels? Kiati Mundi action. He's a Jedi no. with a pointy head. You? How many of these do you have? I have, I have seven or eight from three different series. <laughs> Why? Cause... Oh my god, I just googled <laughs> Kiati Mundi action figure and you and Kate are in the Google Images. I'm not even That's kidding! That's hilarious. <laughs> like, literally, my Google search is Kiati Mundi action figure. And and here, stream, look, boom, there it is. Well, oh, I so the thing is, figures. like, I think it came up because we were talking about how stupid the Jedi are in the prequels. There's, like, fish yeah. Jedi, and then Kiati Mundi is, like, weird head Jedi. And then it became kind of like a joke. And then this one viewer sent us, every month he sent us like two Kiati Mundi action figures. And that's, yeah. it doesn't feel right to throw them in the trash. So, yeah. anyway, we're going to move to GeoGuessr. So, like, if any, will you put up anything that I send you on, like, your shelf? No. <laughs> like, we've gotten, we've, some people have sent us some stuff that we've thrown in the trash. <laughs> I'm, I'm just being Was honest. It? Like, how many sex toys have we we've been? We sent zero sex toys. One dude did send us condoms. Did he use them? <laughs> That's kind of a personal question, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know. We'll be back in three minutes. Geo <laughs> guesser. <laughs> There's also a picture of Jess's puppy in the Discord. I can't like link was, in was... Discord. I don't have permission. <laughs> what? Yeah, you, you should wow, be able bro. to. I, it, no, it says you do not have permission. What? Wait, no, in alpaca chat? Oh, 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 I meant Discord. Discord? This, this, the one that we're speaking in now? Yeah, yeah go, this is go, a... go, Scroll up to, like, the hashtag alpaca chat. Yeah. Oh. Is yeah. that where people link stuff? Okay. Yeah. yeah. That's where people link stuff. All okay. things really go through there. What is this? <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. fucking great. <laughs> that's that's third row. That's like r- really high. I know. Up. I was. I didn't expect. I wasn't like scrolling through. I was just like, what the fuck? That's Kate and Ryan. <laughs> that's pretty rad. That is that is hilarious. Um. Yeah. That's right. Uh. Ev- everyone in Europe. Uh. Check your clock. Ooh. <laughs> By the way, Europe. Forgot about that. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Europeans, yeah. Hello, hello, uh, Europe. Yeah. Welcome. Europeans on my boot. Mm. <laughs> what? Europeans yeah. on my boot. All right. Dude, I hate daylight savings. Why? I think I don't really care. 
most of the time. Fall backwards, thumbs up. I love it. Mm. Spring forwards, no. I don't like it. Yeah. I don't... It doesn't, like, factor into my life equation at all. Well, I think Same. if you... Okay, I was going to roast Rob, but now it feels like I... Now that there's two think, people on the we, one side. Didn't we establish Rob and I are pretty similar? You guys, That's yeah, true. You're, yeah, you're like mirror like, images. Yeah. <laughs> it's Basically just, true. uh, it's just. I was gonna say, yeah, I mean, if you get up at 2 p.m., it probably or 2 a.m. or 2 a.m. or, or, or 8 a.m. <laughs> or 8 p.m. Who knows? No, 8 a.m. I think. A surprise. On eight for 8 a.m., I think it does matter. Uh, why? Because you probably you lose an hour of sleep. Yeah, but, but like, but why do you have to get up us? then? Yeah. Just don't get up. That's what I'm saying. It doesn't matter what time we wake up. So I, for us, it doesn't matter. It really. does matter because exactly. I why I do need to keep a schedule. This is how you end up with a math situation where you're perpetually like falling in. You're tumbling through sleep schedules. In but fairness, that's, fine. that's where I am as well, right? Now. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Same. It's a problem. <laughs> it's a problem for Ryan. Why is it a problem though? Like, okay, a, I have no internal clock. Because he's clock. a control freak. I'm actually uh, not true, a control man. freak. <laughs> I love not having control, to be honest with you. Well, having a schedule is just good. I mean, he's like a married dude with a house, building shelves, That's right? And saving That's his cats. That's true. You are building so, shelves. Yeah. We don't have. That's a house. like the most adult. <laughs> 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 Everything uh, else is is correct though. Dude, I wanted to mention the shelf situation. Yeah. There's your seat, by the way. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Um, I, I like, like, uh, I've, I've, you know, had to build things that I've ordered as, as everyone in life. Wait, I'm where'd sure. you put the scene? It's in the Discord? Yeah, Which it's Discord? Can I put it in, I put it in Skype? Yeah, just put okay. it in, uh, put it in RLS if, if you want to get it quick. But, um, but also it's, it's just an alpaca chat. It's right there. Kinghorn? I don't have any context for what you just said, so. <laughs> so in Alpaca Chat, there's like this weird. Sh oh, I see. I'm fucking stupid. <laughs> just scroll up a little bit. You see Northern. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got it. I'm good. All right, I'm here. I'm sorry. Uh, stand by, though. Okay. But, so. Yeah. There we go. Okay. You gotta build it right out of the box. You got it, Mister. What's? what's I don't want it. Okay. You know yeah, what I, mean? I like, wouldn't what? do that. <laughs> well, then what are, what are you going to do? You're just going to leave it in the box? <laughs> I would like a service or something that, like, I'm sure this exists. You, they, they, they do. Yeah, you, you can, can pay, pay You can pay Ikea to set up your furniture for you. Yeah. That's nice. But, I mean, like, what if you order it on Amazon? Does Amazon ship full desks? Out of like a moving van. I don't believe so, <laughs> no. <laughs> um, See, because I would like that. Have you guys started, by the way? Yes. Oh no, am I supposed oh, to? Yeah, yeah, please, yeah. please do. Oh, starting. I shall begin. Oh, good. Can I this is a... call? Hello, Kate. Hi. Oh, oh. Hello. hi, Kate. Hi. How are you? I'm real tired, and I just need to sit down and can't do anything because uh, woke up, built the shelf, and Ryan broke in half, and uh, <laughs> I didn't break it in half. Lots of, <laughs> lots of stress surged inside of me, but I had to. You know, calm it down because it wasn't. Uh, it wasn't because he wanted to. It was an accident. But <laughs> well, Kate you know, will tell. We 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 do not. So like, I bought two, so that we can have one on the each side of the TV, so it's symmetrical. Mm -hmm. But now there's only one, so there's just it's just it's chaos, not though. symmetrical yeah. and. Yeah. Uh, I'm a little bit of a perfectionist, a little bit of like OCD, and it kills me. So I'm, I'm just kind of trashed the living room, just kind of hi hiding inside my room right now. We'll get the <laughs> same shelf and build it properly this time. But Kate can attest, like, I say on this show that when it comes to like building stuff, I'm literally brain dead. Like, linguistically, yeah. I think I'm intelligent. And in terms of like visual spatial reasoning, eh, jury's out. Yeah. To 10 IQ. Literally. <laughs> so we had, after I broke the shelf, we built the shelf again, a different shelf. And then we built like these little tiny squares. There's four pieces for the, <laughs> for the shelf. Literally, there's like, there's four walls. And then there's like a little thin piece that you slide in at the back. 
Kate just starts putting it together. I'm looking at it like with my eyes wider than they've ever been in my life. Like, how do these four pieces go together to make a box? It doesn't make any sense to me. Like a box with one open face. I literally, I had to look at the instructions and I looked at the instructions and I was like, I know they're right side up, but my brain is saying that they're upside down. Like, it's just, I, I can't, it doesn't make sense to me. At least it takes longer to make sense to me. It was, no, I, it was just, it's a square and you just needed to put, <laughs> you know, like how squares are there. Like every side is exactly the same. You just needed to put it together. And then Ryan said, how did you do that? And I said, just put it together. It's a square. But <laughs> Kate did put one of her pieces in upside down. I did. Oh, I did. Uh, gosh, darn it, Kate. Kate. Well, it's not but as bad then as I fixed it, though. Well, Mathis, Ryan fixed it you, together. Thank you, yeah. We fixed it. We fixed it together. Oh, that's it's good. not. It's 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 still good. That's a nice husband wife bonding experience. Yeah, you know, <laughs> it wasn't. It wasn't. The bonding degree wasn't super high at the moment of the shelf breaking, but it came back over the course of the remaining hour and a half or so. <laughs> Damn it! I I think before you know how when people decide to get married. I think the one task that you have to go through is that the couple has to finish building one IKEA furniture yeah. together. And if mm. the relationship still is intact after they're done with uh, IKEA furnish, uh, I guess like the ultimate test, yeah. then they they shall get married. If not, then like they're not married. I think they should have to build it in front of all the people at their wedding too. <laughs> <laughs> like that should be like before they're able to do the you, must, you may kiss the bride. They should do like they we're gonna not a tough piece of furniture, but just like the the one that we did. Mm -hmm. oh. I think that would be ideal. Did you? Dude, I don't know. One? The the one that I broke. Because <laughs> it's not about successfully putting the piece of furniture together. It's about the way that you like your demeanor during it. If it takes you two hours, it takes you two hours. If it takes you ten minutes, if it takes you ten minutes. If it takes you two hours and you're screaming at each other, that's when it's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, can I mention? I just remembered <laughs> when we were building the shelf. There's like it's supposed to be magnetic, like it's magnetic <laughs> door, right? <laughs> it's a magnetic door, so there's a little bit, like a little piece, like a like a tiny cylinder of magnet strip, so that it will be magnetic shot. But then <laughs> I'm like, Ryan, let's let's start. And then Ryan, Ryan's like, Hey, Kate, look. They, they actually included this magnetic screwdriver. <laughs> I looked at it. It was just magnetic strip. It wasn't it was a screwdriver. I thought it was a whatsoever. little screwdriver, but it was actually the latch that the door <laughs> used. Was, and... I was laughing so hard. I'm just like, why is it just magnet? It's not a screwdriver. And then he like looked at it really confused, like what? And then, and then we were silent for ten minutes. Like, we couldn't, I couldn't. I couldn't laugh because I, I didn't want to be rude. But this, <laughs> it was it was so funny. Did you guys? Uh, did you finish game one or like level one? I did. Yes. Okay, okay. I did. Forty nine seventy. I'm on the second one, just going through. Okay. Uh, cool. I will, going through. I'll move on fucking well. nothing. Oh yeah, it's forever. Yeah, yeah. Let me know when you guys are done with that one, and we'll get back on track. Yeah, it's garbage. Yeah. Well, where uh, where was the second one at? Well, it's not. Oh, don't tell me! Don't tell me! I'm not done. Yeah. What are you talking about? That what? was our ticket. We could have won. Yeah, Hafu, come on now. What? <laughs> my bad, my bad. Hafu, please. This is, you're, you're like the kid who, like, at the end of class is like, yeah, but teacher, you well, didn't What's the homework? homework? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 uh, man, I've actually done that once, and I remember oh. feeling really bad. I still, you know, you just remember some things sometimes. That's, mm. like, one of the memories. Like, oh, shame. I, Everyone hated me. But and I felt really bad. I understand that that's not the right thing to do. But the motivation is never, because I've been this kid as well, is never, <laughs> like, I want to give the other 25 people homework. It's always, like... Well, two days ago, you said there's going to be homework. Are we still going to, like, do I need to do it tonight? I don't want to get in trouble tomorrow because, you know, you didn't remind us. That's exactly mm -hmm. something a narc would say. <laughs> what would you do? Yeah. <laughs> you have plausible deniability. You could say, well, you didn't. That's what I mean. You, then so that's I'm what you're taking away. Trouble. You're taking away the plausible deniability. Mm hmm. Yeah. He did that in this class. 
I I have not done that. It wasn't time. when he was grade eight. It was when well, okay. Last I will. Week. It's possible that as of like you know, even within the last year, I've been that guy. But here's why: it's week six, and then on the syllabus it says week seven is the midterm, and the teacher's like, "Well, that does it for class this week. See you next week." And I put on my hand and I go, "Hey, do we have a fucking exam next week? <laughs> or or like, are we just supposed to show up?" Or and he's like, "Oh, right, that's right. You do have an exam next week. Here's the." Here's the criteria for it. You suck. Yeah, that is <laughs> like, you did that as an adult. That's impressive. So you guys are gonna shoot. Like, you guys are gonna show like, up for the midterm, having <laughs> not studied because he didn't mention it. I'm gonna show I up. Don't think he would make you. I'm gonna it. show up having studied either way, and I'm gonna blow out the curve. You guys are gonna have to drop <clears throat> out. You're a shit. Go live in Dennis's <laughs> attic. <laughs> Well, hate you. Hate your guts. He's actually offering his attic. Uh, oh, for real? Yeah. That's Airbnb. pretty nice. Awesome. All right, I started number three. Uh, all right, I'm on three. I'm on three. I will do this. Let's go. Oh, 500. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Ugh, too big. I got a 1,000, um, so I'll take it. Whoa, on the third one? Yeah, on, the, on, the, third on the second one, one. On the second one. Oh, I Dude, got like... Uh, oh, but no. speaking of building things, like, just straight up, I know I'm not I'm not handy. I have no I have no qualms with I'll that. I'll give you one. You know? <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> hit me up after the show, Josh, and uh, we'll work something out. Um, but uh, no, like I know I'm not ha- like there, there are like some traditional like male archetypal stuff that men are supposed to be good at, like being handy or like not wanting to ask for directions. Yeah, I bo- both of those things I don't I don't care about at all. I don't I don't know, man. Well, I, I you don't care or you're bad at it. <laughs> well, I'm bad at it. Yeah, like, but also, like, I don't care about asking for directions. Like, there's no, I have no, I have no issue. With no, that. I don't. I will never ask for directions. But it's not, it's not out of pride. It's just because Google Maps is better than the human brain. Yeah. Like, if I'm asking, yeah, like, a person yeah, will like yeah. tell me like where to go, but like I don't want to use any of their fucking information. Oh, like, go knows? walk to this street, turn right, and then I think it's this at this building. Go up two yeah. floors. Google Maps is just better. Yeah. But, like, I'll, Kate will recognize. Here's what happened, is that, like, I went down, because she's like, hey, the cat food that we ordered from Amazon is here. So I went down to get the cat food, and then the dude was like, by the way, you have six other boxes. Do you want to take them up? And I picked one up, and I was like, oh, it's the freaking furniture. So I brought it all up on the hand truck, and then Kate was like, I'll put it together. And I was like, I can't just sit there. And like record video games, <laughs> and my <laughs> wife's like putting together a shelf in the other room. So I came out and I was like, "I'll help," but now she probably wishes I didn't because I broke the one shelf. <laughs> yeah. But at the same time, I did, it didn't feel right for me to just be sitting in my office, you know, doing my white collar labor while my my wife is out there building the furniture yeah, Kate, by herself. Kate, Kate is a homie. Yeah, I, I would never offer to Asian too. <laughs> she is Asian. <laughs> Don't you forget ever, it. Ever, Wait, really? Ever. I have not heard that, yeah. Wait, half of what did you say? Sorry. Oh, I would never offer to build furniture alone. I don't think <laughs> that would ever come out of my mouth, so that's like... Look, I reached the end of this one. Wait, really? Yeah. Go, Kate, you know, we've been together long enough that she knows... I'm, if anything, I'm probably going to be a detriment. Well, I mean... <laughs> well, if this is like... the number, can I type this number into No, Google? that's obviously cheating. <laughs> All right. I think I tried to build this really easy CD case shelf when we first moved in. And then uh, Ryan put one of the last board. Like, I was really, like, tight on time because I was still on, going to school. And then I just asked Ryan, like, hey, I finished, like, 99% of it. Just Could you just put that wood piece onto the bottom and and then it would be done? And then Ryan's like, oh, not, not a problem. And then, you know, he actually put it, like, upside down, like, inside out kind of way. So literally, he just needed to put this wood piece, but he fucked it up. So I'm just like, well, like he fucked it up. And then Ryan's like, well, you didn't say you need to be in this like particular order. I'm like, well, it's like basic knowledge, yo. Like, and that's where upside down. That's where like you gotta look yeah, at that's me. That's where I started to build everything. By myself. <laughs> that's why when I look at the instructions, even looking at the instructions, I gotta take my time and like. I almost rewrite the instructions in my head. I go like, "Oh, believe me, I I've tried to explain things to you in Factorio. I know." I no, understand. but you're you also have a problem with explanation, okay? <laughs> I do. You're right. You're not wrong. It's like That's I'm like, cool. "Hey, what 
how do you drink a glass of water? And you're like, well, okay, well, like, the first thing is liquid takes the shape of whatever <laughs> container you put it in. And I'm like, what the hell? Look, I just like to be thorough, okay? <laughs> I'm thorough in my explanations. That's all it is. But the idea well, like, is, I actually, by, yeah. by yeah. practicing building, I will slowly get better at it. But until then, we're probably going to break a few shelves. But eventually, I'll be I decent. Mean, we, so after, after that, we did like an intervention kind of session. We are like, hey, Ryan, you know, you're, I'm probably going to marry you and I cannot marry you like this. So we're going to buy a Lego and we're going to build a Lego. Yeah. And then we'll improve one by one. And then Ryan's like, okay. And then we started with the Lego and it was getting better. And then we did a little bit of origami and then it was getting better. And then we bought this uh, coffee table that had total steps of three or four. It was just put one like this piece over this piece and put the top that's it and then it took ryan 30 minutes and i'm like <laughs> ryan <laughs> come on <laughs> and then like on the other side i was building this like tv table but um and then today he broke a shelf i'm yeah. i'm sure one day he will get better it's it's happening but. slowly but surely you Damn, I didn't think we had that. anything in common, but Ryan, that sounds a lot like me. Oh, yeah? <laughs> there you go. I'm, I'm, in terms of, like, being handy, Handiness? Yeah, yeah, completely useless. What happened yeah. is, like, my my grandfather uh, ran, like, his own construction and drywall company, and then my dad and my uncle worked for him when they were, like, 14 and up until they hit, like, their 20s and or mid-20s, at least, to graduate from university. So whenever we would build anything around the house as a kid, they'd always be like, okay, Ryan, come help. And then they'd give me a job and I'd do it wrong. And they'd be like, okay, well, we can just do it a hundred times faster. So they just did it for me. And then now that I'm an adult, I've never, ever been forced to actually build anything myself. So I just lack the, I lack the tools. Dude. I, I feel you. I have my, my my giant TV is on like a uh, on like this metal stand thing, and I just, Dennis just came over and basically built it for me, which, <laughs> which is which is great. But you know, I didn't learn anything. You gotta you be handy, man. Better luck next time. Wow, thanks, Gabe. That's kind of kind of got shit on. Do you that. do you at least change your light bulbs? Well, yeah. well, that's okay. Well, that's slanderous, Kate. I could, <laughs> I could change our light bulbs easily. I've changed light yeah, you bulbs. Don't change your light bulbs. Kate changes Zero, the light bulbs, but I'll tell you what: it's not because I can't change the light bulbs. It's because I literally never know just when the lights are out. Like I'll walk out and I'll be like, "Oh, it looks different out here," and Kate will be like, "Yeah, the light bulb's blown." And like, oh, are you it. an alien? <laughs> 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 you can't tell when the lights off. I've changed the light bulbs many times in my life. <laughs> no, not with us. When we've been together for like six years or more, <laughs> not even a single light bulb. I'm. I don't know. Like, I'm extremely low maintenance. Mm. <laughs> That's a nice way to put it. I if it would take until like all the lights went out in the apartment, and I'd be like, I should probably buy some light bulbs. We blow one light bulb, Kate's like, we need a light bulb. That's the way it should work. I'll admit. I mean, in fairness, the the entire like all of the light in my room is from my computer monitor. See, that's um, <laughs> like this. Well, I mean, I, I have I have a lamp because the my ceiling light is broken. Wait, broken um, or the bulb is out? No, no, no. no. It's like broken, bro. Like it doesn't matter how many times you change the light bulb. It's just, it's just broke. Um, and I, you know, I, I've just never gotten the super into fix it. So I have a lamp, but I pretty much never turn it on because I don't really need to. Okay. So, you know. By the way, I'm on number five right now. I don't know if we're like super. Oh, I'm done. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm five. All right, I'll. I'll... Try to... I'm done. I already lost. It already told me. <laughs> well, when, when we give out the seed publicly, someone cheats. And by someone, oh, yeah, I mean like six people. It. This guy got this one 79 meters away. Like, I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh <laughs> my god, the camera's so bad it goes uh, to Dutch angle. It, it gets screen. better, but it is directed by Kenneth Brana. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Man, I don't know. I've actually never changed a light bulb, but none of my lights have gone. Like I've only lived in a place for like a year. This You've is never had a light bulb go out. 
That's, um, that's like a that's a more no, maybe that's a more Ryan. that's a more preposterous never, statement than I, I saying you never change your life. Okay, a life. Okay, okay, okay. I actually, what I the had fuck this... are you trying to pull? <laughs> I had this discussion with David because what he does, I'm really good about turning off the lights, and okay. I'm sorry, oh, but it's not All about right, electricity. Yeah. It's just about really me good. not wanting to change the light bulbs. Actually. And so David always leaves the lives, leaves his lights on everywhere, like bathroom, his like his stream room, everywhere. And I'm, it's like annoying because I know it's gonna burn out. Yeah. And then we're gonna have to get new light bulbs, and neither of us want to do that. So yeah, I explained that to him. It's not that big of a deal, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> <laughs> you have to get like a license or anything. <laughs> I'm getting the light bulbs. <laughs> yeah, I explained this to him, <laughs> and I was on. I was like, what do you do at your place? And he's like, oh, just all my light bulbs are burnt. <laughs> are you serious? He lives in the dark. And he's like, yeah, my bathroom has no light. Because I'm turning oh my the light bulbs. I was like, okay. Well, I don't want that to be our apartment. Yeah. So please turn off the lights. And I can't believe but that at man one actually point, exists. At some point, you are going to have to purchase a light bulb, though. Unless you, yeah. when a light blows, you're just gonna move. But the, okay, okay. The, <laughs> well, we're gonna move soon, actually, to LA, probably. Ooh. But um, oh, well, there you go. Yeah, Where it's, it's all you know, it's, in that time. It's sunny. The so. light bulbs are almost all gonna <laughs> die, so it's uh, time to leave. So you're really leaving uh, quite the job for the person that moves in <laughs> yeah, next, right? That they're, person after that, they're fine. they're gonna be like, oh my god, <laughs> honey. I have to buy every can, single light in this house. Honey, can you I'm buy sure four light bills. bulbs? <laughs> For me, I and and then clear four minutes off my schedule so I can fix these lights. <laughs> I mean, yeah, but like that's actually a great for scenario for him because he could be like, oh shit, Hafu, let, I'm gonna, I'm the handyman, I'm gonna change these lights. Don't worry about it. It's super hard. You won't have to worry about it. Uh, let me handle this. And then you fucking unscrew them and screw them back in. And then there, you got light. And then, like, he's like the world's savior for Hoffman. That's true. It's like, it's an easy way to get uh, some brownie points. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's why, yeah, like, actually, when we do chores, I always offer to take down the garbage because, like, it's heavy. That's the easiest that's, one. It's heavy, and all you got to do is pick something up and put it back down a little later, yeah. right? So I'm like, that's a dream come true. And then Kate goes, Thanks for taking out the garbage. And I go, You're welcome. And I put a tone on it like it was a big deal. But actually, it was kind of like a, it was kind of like a nice little walk. <laughs> it's my pleasure. You always, you always say whenever you go down at one a.m., you have to like bring out the key in between your knuckle just in case a homeless come homeless guy come to you. And drop you. We do, uh, we do occasionally have like a a vagabond will. He's gonna yeah rob you for your trash. Well, like uh, our, our building's pretty. <laughs> hey, you got trash, dude. Our, <laughs> we, your trash. Kate can vouch for it. We went down into the garbage and recycling room once, and there was like a really sweaty dude in an ill-fitting T-shirt. And I was like, oh, that's nice. Somebody from the recycling company's here. And then later, we saw him steal one of the recycling bins on his bike and try to carry it. But then his bike tipped over, and all the cans and bottles went all over the sidewalk. Shh. He fell over, and then all the glass bottles broke, and he said, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> he, just, he just left, I Did think. Did you laugh at him? Now, I, I kind of did. Good. Well, it was a funny. I mean, just watching that piece of shit. watching that's somebody. He's just trying to make his way in this sad, fucking yeah. world, that's and you're laughing at him. He was just making like two dollars. He would just like, yeah. like you know how many bottles? Well, bottles. I had. Like, I, I wasn't stealing. You weren't. Well, he was he's stealing. he was stealing the recycling bin. <laughs> well, but yeah. He, he, he still had bottles bin. inside, right? He's just trying to live. I know, but like, our money pays for the recycling bin. And plus, what they the, use the what? they use the they use the money they use the money from the bottles to throw some parties with some light Which refreshments and stuff there? like that. So Wait, really, he on. is stealing like a glass of fruit punch right out of my pocket. Oh, in the whole scheme. Oh no! However, oh. you live. Which oh. guy scoring Geo? Uh, eleven thousand. Sixteen zero. I also got eleven thousand. You guys did so good. So well. I got yeah, I kind of cheated. Every time I looked at chat, they told me. Because I didn't know. I mean, I, I would glance at my chat. And you cheated. <laughs> I, yeah. That's bullshit. <laughs> the one like, time I, you remember that one I like, time I asked Ryan, like, where we are? And yeah. you're like, no, Josh, we can't do that. 
I didn't say that. I said yes, get you the did. Marrow. Yes, you fucking did. Don't lie to all me. All right, all right. I'll give you another seed real quick here. <laughs> but and people were like, I'm a bad person. The dude took. Well, yeah. The, I'm not mad he took the bottles. I'm being real <laughs> well, with you. Well, yeah. That, that, part, that part is a joke <laughs> about being mad he took the bottles. But I was a little yeah. annoyed that he took the recycling container because then we have to buy another one of those and if we don't buy another one of those then the buildings all like the thing is people go down to the trash room and they go oh well i'm already here so there's no place to put my trash i'll just put it on the ground and then you, you go yeah. back a week later and it's all stinky and there's like insects and stuff everywhere so he is making a hassle but there was another time i came down with like two garbage bags and there was a dude in the garbage room and he was like hey do you have any like glass bottles in those garbage bags and I, I just looked at him like, are you expecting me to rip open the garbage and hand you a glass bottle out of the garbage? I'm putting it in the garbage, the trash compactor, you madman. So I just said no. <laughs> but I, th- I hoped that 90% of my communication was nonverbal. Like, hey, dude, I'm not mad at you for like being here. And I understand like desperate times call for desperate measures. But I'm not ripping through this trash to give you a glass bottle. You want to give me a seat? Yeah, I'd like a seat. Dude, I – so <laughs> – <laughs> it, that, that's a classic laugh of like i'm not sure if i'm gonna tell this story but <laughs> <laughs> well this one's this one's not bad really but like it was it, it's another it's another dentist story so when, we're, when we were young i love dentist about, stories yeah <laughs> there's, there's your seat by the way we can we can begin we, we wait where's the seat wait, it's in it? skype it's in skype oh it's in skype oh i like this one Wait, I didn't get it. I'm not in your Skype chat. That's correct. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll put it in the Discord as well. Wait, mine didn't. What? Wow, pretty. Um, okay, I, I won't look at my chat a single time. Yeah. I, I probably oh, this that. is nice. So I will have I probably like you're gonna a score. Lie of... <laughs> I didn't lie. I was honest. Oh, no, you you lied. Oh no, actually, lying. technically you didn't. But yeah, I did I'm lie. You did so. You can't no. stop me. That's true. She was technically honest about her dishonest practices. The dude she asked. Was dishonest. <laughs> I love, by the way, I'm being vilified for not giving this dude a glass bottle out of my garbage can. Josh, well, yeah. Josh throws out <laughs> money. Yeah. Literal <laughs> money. Like. Yep. It's like I'll do it you... all day long. I don't give a fuck. Ask me if I well, give a fuck. Well, you know, coins are annoying. No, ask me if I give a fuck, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it the time that he actually just threw coins on the ground? Well, he he just what? If he loses like a penny or something, he's just like I'm, I don't care about I that. I leave penny. it. Yeah, yeah. It belongs if to I, the ground. Like I would, like I was telling them earlier, I would rather pick up like trash off the ground and remove that trash from the ground than actually pick up like loose change and throw it in yeah, a waste basket. What is going on with it? I can't move. You can move. Man, this is... I'm trying to move, but I can't move. I'm oh. not going to look at chat, but this is going to really show how uncultured I am. I'm actually the most uncultured piece of shit. Like, <laughs> I, know, I know zero about anything, actually. You should like, play some EU4. About what? Play some what? <laughs> Europe or Universalis 4. We're driving... No, that implies that this is in Europe or the universe. Mm-hmm. Good point. It's in, it's in, it's in Europe. Uh, but Tell me more. Driving, I would say that this is in somewhere on the Eurasian continent. Yes, I would think so. Yeah. Okay. Um. But yeah. So, so anyway, yeah. Odd jobs with Dennis. So we used to do a lot of odd jobs to like kind of you know make some make some cash. Well, like you'd have like a pointy hat that you'd throw at people and chop their heads off. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, this is a, James Bond. James Bond. Um, right. Uh no. No, we wouldn't do that. Uh, but we would uh, like, we would, uh, like what one one scheme was like. It wasn't really much of a scheme, but it was just like we would go to like estate sales and stuff. Yeah, and and I got to the end. To, like, yeah, I got to the end as well. Just what trying to like flip things. But one time we we decided to like just try to make money, just you know, taking people's recycling to uh, a That's place. That's not a job. Well, well yeah, it's, it's kind of a job. It's a, it's Wait, a, did you steal the recycling? I like, well, so or you you yeah. uh you circumvented like you you got to the recycling before the city did, and then you took it to the <laughs> hypothetically. If this happened, 
hypothetically, we may have carted into a couple of apartment buildings and gotten their recycling. Wow. Oh, you were the guy that I hated. You <laughs> you did a, a t legally. I hate you. Legally, <laughs> it's a breaking and entering. Yeah, that's a. To that's steal a, someone's a, garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Look, this is and, and this is hypothetical. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is, but, but you know. So, but um, yeah. No. It uh, uh, anyway. But the whole point of the story is that uh, <laughs> it is not worth it yeah. at all. Like it, 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 like we carried like <laughs> fucking like twenty pounds wait, of wait. Fucking Dennis trash. didn't even like use his car. Uh, well, this is this is when we were younger, so this is like I don't think he had a car at the time. You were walking well, it to the recycling depot. Well, <laughs> well, you can go to a supermarket. They have the little. Oh my god! Yeah, you Wait, were homeless. They have the supermarket. <laughs> you were actually yeah. living the life of a homeless person, except you were sleeping in a bed. We we wanted to see what it was like, uh, and you know, figured like, hey, you know. Uh, Why don't you just make, drink make a, a can of Coke and return it at the cashier? There you go. Well, you gotta buy the can <laughs> of Coke first, though. It was five. That's five cents. That's <laughs> oh my god. I like. I like the fact. I like the fact that uh, when Dennis or you brought up the idea, like, hey, why don't we go to a place and uh, snack some empty bottles and cans and go to a supermarket and return it. And then at that point, you're like, oh, that sounds like a great idea. But then the <laughs> part that actually got you like, hmm, maybe not so good idea was the fact that when you were hauling that giant stinky sack mm -hmm. of empty bottles and you return it to the superstore and then you got like ten dollars don't they like, like late what don't they have a limit as well like you one person can only bring back like 12 bottles a day or something what uh that's the way why? it works at our grocery stores because and everyone thinks oh they've seen three homeless people in their life and i am talking about sometimes being frustrated with the homeless population and they go you're rude vancouver is like i'm trying to think of a nice way to phrase it but lots of homeless people. Lots of homeless yeah. people. Some parts of it are like, kind of like The Walking Dead. <laughs> like when they go outside, you just see like. Maybe you shouldn't say. Okay, that. I didn't mean. I know they're. <laughs> but there's there's like yeah. systems in place oh, in the city that are like, you can only bring back like twenty bottles a day because if we didn't put a limit, one cashier would be here all day. Scanning bottles from like the same thirty or forty uh, people. Well, see, that's your problem if they if the cashier has to scan the bottles. Yeah, so, well, like, not scan machines? the bottles, but you I know what I mean. Machines, they right? well, they they yeah. count them or you just like put your bottle in and you get five cents. I remember that. That's yeah, not the uh, that's not dead. how it works here. Okay, The Walking <laughs> Dead was not a good way to explain it. It's a show with diseased zombies who, you know, the zombies are more of a nuisance for sure. <laughs> and they're they're much less savable, <laughs> which is clear. I'm just saying there's a huge worse. there's a huge homeless population here, so there's like safeguards in place at these grocery stores that are like I've seen grocery store clerks be like you we've already taken your bottles in today you can't donate more you can't I've get any clerks. more. <laughs> I can't find it's, any words. It's the liquor store. Yeah, I remember because it's what happens is that people <sighs> actually steal away from all the neighborhood and it only kind of. I don't know. We encourage them to break into other oh, no. people's houses to steal the bottles. Mm, so like they only allow them by weight, I think. What? Not like 12, not 12 bottles, but, you know, maybe like a one full bag of garbage bag. And after that, you cannot return it because then oh. you know, people I'm just break in. I'm starting to understand why Vancouver still has a bad homeless problem. If well, the like, real reason no, is wait, go go look at here, uh, <laughs> go look at a weather report from Canada in December and see that the rest of the country is angry snowmen and Vancouver is the sun with the sunglasses on, going like it's all good, bro. That's the that's one of the reasons we have a lot of homeless people in Vancouver. Yeah, I believe it's because you can. I thought they were mostly American, actually. I, I mean, I've never asked. I, everyone, every Vancouver I've ever met has their own mythos for why there's so many. It's, oh, there's a, a mayor in Alberta gave the homeless people a bus ticket and told them to go to oh, Vancouver. Oh, that's true, though. Said, it, it's true. I have never seen any, like, record or proof of that in my entire... I think it's mostly, like, people from America that just came over the border no, like, and never a left. Lot of, 
the the true fact is a lot of states like some of the states and some i don't know about the provincial in canada but i know for the fact that some uh i guess like states in east coast they would the government will buy you one-way ticket to whichever place and many people will choose either california or wow. vancouver and hey, they will just go this, there like do you think that they just like had like a, a sign-in sheet for like the homeless people and there's like a fill in the blank sort of like questionnaire oh, or do you think there is like a few bubbles it. that they got to choose from i think what they do is the um they will I just i just want to wanna see a source yeah <laughs> that's all i'm asking for i'm pretty like, sure there would be if you like, if you see thing. vancouver <laughs> like vancouver homeless population if you just google that i'm pretty sure you will come up with a result that most of them are American. That's what I mean like when an like official like city a guy who like goes underneath the bridge is like, hey, you guys <laughs> gonna go to Portland or Vancouver? Check out the West Coast. I think I think so. I think some people actually go around and ask like, where are you? Where are you from? I don't no, believe I'm so. Serious. I really don't. I think so. That's what. But like, the Vancouver population is not not large enough for all of Vancouver's homeless people to be Vancouverites. But I do feel as someone who is like an outsider and came to the city. The people that have grown up here are like, none of them are from Vancouver. And I'm like, ah, that guy's wearing a Matthias Olin jersey, and he hasn't played for the Canucks since, like, 1999. So... No, <laughs> I mean, you did not. That guy's that's, wearing... That's a, that's a made That up guy's story. wearing a vintage Vancouver that's Grizzlies story, jersey. Dude. So I think that the reason, okay, they moved for, in the year me. 2000. No. For for me, the like the source that I saw was during high school and middle school. They will show you like, hey, don't do drugs, yeah. blah blah blah. And those documentaries are filmed in the East Hastings, which is the drug addict kind of alley in Vancouver. And they actually interview them like, hey, where are you from? Uh, like, which drug are you doing? Uh, you know, like <laughs> you got any more? Like, <laughs> <laughs> like they would just kind of like interview them and they were like oh my life sucks blah blah, blah don't do drugs kid kind of things yeah. and when dur during those documentaries and we saw like so many of them because that's what our like health class wor was <laughs> i guess and then they would just say like oh i'm from like you know like east coast in u.s blah blah, blah. Um, and they would usually come to Vancouver. The fact that is in if they go to America and then if they're dying and they don't like to die, the American <laughs> hospitals won't treat them. What a where total it, he doesn't right. want to die. Well, where, I do not where, want to die. I think we. I think we need to stop this. This is just. <laughs> this is, but that's what I saw in the documentary. I think this is gone. This is tumbled down a rabbit hole that. From whence there is no productive escape. <laughs> I've got a I've got a sad homeless guy story. Please do. Let's All fucking right, do so, it. So there was this. Uh, so so in my neighborhood in in New York City, like like on the sidewalks, they're lined with um, trees every every couple of feet. I've heard of them. But, yeah. Yeah. Well, trees. See, but the thing is, yeah, but they're they're not really kept very well. Like it's pretty much like a tree growing in like a sand lot that is fed on like piss and like <laughs> rat, like rat blood yeah nutrients so like it right exactly so it, it's not they're not very healthy trees usually um because nobody really cares about them uh but then there was this homeless guy in my neighborhood who was like there he, he took one specific tree like one specific lot and he just like like he cared the shit out of that tree because he uh, he was like cleaning up the area around it. He was building like this mosaic tile thing, hey. like all around. Like like it it made he made it like really pretty. Um, and he was working on it for months. I used to you know when I would go to school, I'd walk by and I'd see him working on it and stuff. And he would just he would just be making this tree look really nice. Man, there is oh. there are so many conceivable ways for this story to end that are all heartbreaking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like well, right I mean, now, I'm it, like, oh, did. Some shitheads came came by and like kicked his tree over, and he was crying. Or the homeless dude got sick and he couldn't tend to the tree, and the tree died. And like, there's so the, w w just give give it to me straight. It's a, it well, it was the it was the pretty obvious way, which is that the the city came and just shut it down. Like they said, you're not allowed to touch 
public property and they tore out the mosaic and everything <laughs> and oh my god and, yeah and like and like you know now the they, they basically said it was vandalism and uh wow. and so now the tree is back to what it used to look like which is just like a dirty old dirt sand shit tree just sit, sitting out there it's a metaphor <laughs> was that the tree that you fell over when we were in new york <laughs> no no that's a different tree <laughs> how can you be sure now because they all look the same right mm, that's a good point good point well those the trees in manhattan are actually pretty well kept i will say uh, rob did you see any of the vlogs the the south korea vlogs that i've posted uh bits and pieces on the circle jerk Why? <laughs> yeah that's, that's about so, right so you know you know i told you when we went to shack shack to shack shack burger to eat shack shack burgers and mm -hmm. then i told you that korean people are going crazy over shack shack burgers really? there are so many shack shack burgers in south korea and i was i was like we had to go in to make sure if it's the real or ripped off version and it was the real shack shack burgers. i've told shack shack i've told you <laughs> a couple of times before it's not called shake shack burger it's just <laughs> shake shack i call it shake shack though yeah yeah but she calls it shack shack she... that's a fair point you know i didn't consider that what do you call it right i call it shake shack she calls it Shack Shack. That's funny that you're making fun of someone for pronouncing it. Look, okay. <laughs> Shit rolls downhill. <laughs> I would eat a Shack Shack burger, though. That sounds cool. That also like, sounds cool. Shaquille be involved? It does sound cool. She is right, by the way. Shake Shack was all over South Korea. That's that's yeah. pretty interesting. Also, yeah. like, I mean, the burgers are delicious. Weird American chains that are not as popular in America as they used to be, but are still going strong. Like, mm. Bennigan's? KFC. KFC for oh. sure. Uh, Johnny Rockets. And yep. Outback Steakhouse. Uh, Outback's still probably pretty popular. We were in, like, a, an area that had a train station in it. The Outback Steakhouse was, like, the entire second floor of the train station. Must have had <laughs> 200 tables. We were like, what? "This Outback is fucking crushing it in South That's Korea funny. somehow." Dude, well, it was TGI. There was TGI so Fridays. TGI Fridays, well, yeah. TGI Fridays, and then the Outback came in, and Outback basically took took over the TGI Fridays. So Dude. now there's less TGI Fridays. I, I'm 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 on record for for being pretty pretty. Uh, like Terrible anti chain. Well, that too, yeah, yeah. yeah. Anti chain <laughs> restaurant, anti franchise restaurant. Uh, I've only been to Outback Steakhouse a couple times. It's pretty good. Like yeah. it's it's not bad. Like it's 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 legitimately. I like, never had it. Food. I've only it's been to Outback in uh, in South Korea. I never had it. Is it is it like Montana's? Yes, that was my experience at least. But mm. I've only eaten at this Australian steakhouse once in Asia. So I don't know if I'm a reliable source. Mm. What's the difference? What's the difference between Montana's and Outback? Uh, Montana's is a Canadian restaurant pretending to be <laughs> American. Weird. And you don't even have... Outback is an American restaurant pretending to be Australian. <laughs> That's the way That's we like point, it. Yeah. yeah, like those Bloomin' Onions... That's just, they just made that shit up. They don't eat that shit in Australia. Classic aboriginal dish in Australia. <laughs> what is it? Blooming onion. It's an onion separated into little onion pieces, and then they're all individually deep fried. Mm -hmm. well, like onion rings. Yeah, but they're not rings. They're like they're like French fries. Yeah, mm. and they're like they, they're like uh, they're covered in flour and 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 fried. They're delicious. They're actually very tasty. I remember back in the outback, they used to. Find these Vidalia <laughs> onion patches, and then they would <laughs> douse them in flour and uh, and deep fry them. Yeah, with all that grain that, all, that grows in Australia. Yeah, all all the grain and the shimmering uh, pools of oil heated by direct sunlight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Then again, yep. we live in a city. Food in Vancouver is amazing. I can't stress this enough. Japanese, Korean, Chinese, out of control, good. But they had the, like, they do this thing called the Golden Plates every year. And they are like, well, here's what the readers selected as the best whatevers in the city. Best fries, number three, went to McDonald's. Whole oh, come <laughs> on. 
Dude, I've, a... I've, inter I've interacted with very few Canadians, but every Canadian that I have met, I think, save, like, you and Fox, <laughs> love the shit out of McDonald's. Hey, man. I don't know what, I, I don't know what it is about McDonald's. I like McDonald's. It's, it's, yeah, yeah McDonald's. that's pretty like good McDonald's. up here. I like McDonald's, but, like, I just, like, Ham used to have McDonald's, like, just, you know, a couple of days a week. Just regularly. I mean, I can't really eat it anymore and feel good later, yeah. you know? Like, it's really good when you eat it, but then, like, oh, I'm not, like, eight anymore. I can't just, like, eat whatever the fuck I want and <laughs> Dude, feel okay. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling you on that. Like, I, DoorDash is actually destroying my life because I've eaten way too much McDonald's in, in way too short bursts. Mm. And, like, every time I, I bite into a McDonald's sandwich now... It's just like my body feels like it's dying. Yeah, it's turning you into I vegetable. Mean, it probably nuts. is. <laughs> mm -hmm. Did you guys know? You know the Happy Meals from McDonald's. They're getting rid of the cheeseburgers. What? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Wait. Wait. What? What's, Why? What's the reasoning? The reason is that they decided it's not healthy enough for kids to eat cheeseburgers. Mm. They so should they, their entire menu. Yeah, so you, yeah cannot I, have, I, you cannot have the cheeseburgers in, for the Happy Meals. It's now considered as like a secret menu. So oh. if you were to go there mm. and then ask for it, then they will give you the cheeseburger. But they will now serve something else. I forgot what it was. But not cheeseburger. Chopped up apple. I, feel like it, I, I get Happy Meals when I go to, <laughs> when really? I go to McDonald's. Yeah, because it's like a good amount of food and you get... You get like apple juice. You get a toy as well. <laughs> Good amount of food, she says. Yeah, I wasn't gonna I mean, point we're it not out. Feeling I'm with disgusting. you. <laughs> like, no, that... like if you get a Big Mac, like a like a large. I, I've never had a Big Mac, so I don't large. know. Let's like, go. Mm -hmm. I've never. Okay, I've actually never had one. I've, <laughs> I've also never. Had, did, yeah, wasn't last week. Okay, last yeah. Week. Good. All right. But uh, isn't it like too much food when you have like a large everything? I just feel like you want to puke at that point. Well, like, like I could I could consume it, but I just won't. When you here's the way like it works it. as for me at least is if I got like a ten piece chicken McNugget meal with the fries and a drink. After two nuggets, I'm like I'll probably be full after like two more and some of the fries and the drink, and then you just mm. keep going. Yeah, but then you feel like <laughs> yeah. shittier. Like each bite isn't worth it. So I'd rather just eat like order less because i have no self-control once mm. you know once i have the food in front of me i'm just gonna keep eating it till it's gone yeah See, but i don't have enough self-control to stop myself from making the order in the first place yeah, same. so i still just do it yeah uh... i I'll, I'll eat that shit uh points spread <laughs> yeah 12. seven what oh seven thousand seven hundred i was oh. oh i did okay and then i got fifteen thousand okay whatever Fuck. Josh, you Fuck won. I won. I got mm. fourteen thousand one hundred and seven. I like the the Sweden ones. Those are fun. I, I really like yeah. the one that was one hundred percent Australia, and then when you guessed, it was like, nope, it's America. Everybody I did. Guess everybody America else, then. you did. Yeah, it was yeah. great because like the the world leader, um, he fucking put his in like the goddamn the, ocean. The world leader. Points, so was, <laughs> yeah. I was like, what? Kim Jong Un. Yeah, Kim Jong Un. What? No, it's all like the the champion who's in the lead right now got zero fucking points because he put his like, in the Australian coast. And I was like, yeah, fucking idiot deserves it. I think that was me. Wait, you put it in the I, ocean? I, I put mine in Australia. No, Australian bite. Okay, we got well, you... two. We got two minutes per guess. This is EU only. All right, let's do this. Hopefully, we won't have shit cameras like we have all day today. Chat, you uh, don't... you did the fifty nuggets challenge. Yeah, don't peer pressure Hafu when you're doing the fifty nuggets challenge. <laughs> yeah, Hafu, I still need want... to do it. John, if you get Happy Meals at McDonald's, <laughs> do not do the fifty nuggets. It's challenge. the equivalent of like twelve right Happy Meals. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> literally. I mean, without the fries, but uh, it's... we all did it. And in fact, all of you did it. We all you finished it. We all did it in like a. Kate did it. Kate did I like didn't. twenty. Did did more than Austin. You did do more than Austin. Austin threw up. What? After yeah. after yeah. like nineteen or I think that's that was like fake actual fake news. Like he got to thirty, but we've made it nineteen, and somehow that stuck. He no, I was he got, on the he stream. Got, yeah, yeah, yeah. He he got he got. He started feeling sick after 19, but he made it to 24. Okay. But he yeah. threw off soon after. Yes. 
yeah, yeah. He threw, after, after 24, he was like, all right, I got to go. And then, and then <laughs> we're like, you, you're all right? And he, and he, and he had people. And he wasn't all right. I did. He was not all right. Wait, did you finish it? Yeah. No, he did. Oh, he did. Did anyone finish it? Did anyone finish we it? We all oh, yeah. finished it oh, yeah. except that. Like, I did 51, and then Rob did, like, 50, Why 51? Why did you have to go Because <laughs> Michael A.L. Fox did 50, and I was like, I don't want to tie him. I want to usurp him. And then... Uh, Honestly, you started that arms race. Ra- race <laughs> that race, arms race. race. <laughs> right. And, and I'll never forgive you for that because I got to 57 and I felt awful. Yep. Like at 50, I was like, yeah, this sucks, but it's not that bad. At 57, I was like, I'm dying. Dude, so. when I'm feeling feisty, I get like 10 and that's like too much. <laughs> <laughs> that means I have like leftovers for later. Cause actually, frozen nuggets are okay. Like you just, you know, you they keep you eat them in the yeah. fridge after. I can't eat ten. That's so, crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, say this one more I time, just so I can. I wouldn't hear it touch. And believe it. I wouldn't touch a cold nugget. No, Gus. What? No, it's good. It's good. Oh. They're Dude, good. no, I was I, I was talking to Jess about this the other day. I don't know what McDonald's does to their food. But, like, why does all of their food just become fucking literal garbage when it's cold? Yeah, when it's hot, like, you're like, this is excellent. Like cold fries. No. no oh, cold that's fries. the worst ones. That is the worst one. Oh, worst God. One. Don't make me throw up. It, I think oh if, you, if you don't get those fries inside of you within, like, 20 minutes of when they're in the Deep box, you might as well just toss them. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I, yeah, I feel like the fries are definitely the worst. That but, being said, uh, I do definitely steal some of Kate's after they're cold. So, <laughs> but it's just always kind of a regret because you kind of expect it to be good and you want it to be good, but it's just not. It's just like dry and I don't yeah. know. It's like eating uh, what are those little stuffers? You know, like the <laughs> the um oh, what are they called? The little the little worms that you can like crunch. What? Keep your packages. No, 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 they're not worms. <laughs> worms? They're like foam. The foam Matthew, are you all right? No, like little no, worms. Are you like styrofoam okay, okay, okay. packing? Yeah, yeah, styrofoam thingies. You know the styrofoam? Like they don't really have them anymore. Wait, or maybe what? I don't order yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, like, like, packing, packing peanuts? peanuts. Yeah. Okay, I don't know what they're called. They look like little styrofoam worms. <laughs> that you can crunch. I think my explanation is fine. <laughs> what? You're, you're eating packing peanuts? No, I'm saying that's what McDonald's fries taste like. Packing peanuts? <laughs> it's getting even worse. I am a little confused. So how was your weekend, Kate? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, my weekend? Uh-huh. Uh, it was okay. I, I don't think we did really much. We didn't do we, that much this weekend. Yeah. We did watch the Disaster Artist. Yeah. We, oh, how was that? Yeah. It was pretty good. I did not do it. You got it. You pretty much got it. There. I did. Well, I did not. <laughs> That's that was basically it, yeah. I did um, not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. <laughs> what? You're lying. I never hit her. Um. Appara- so Jess is telling me that apparently packing peanuts can be made out of potato starch. I have heard that. Yeah. Ooh. I did not know That's that. when you're shipping something vegan. <laughs> right. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Did you guys ever watch that video of like this guy eating the world's biggest Cheeto? I don't know why I watched what? this. Because I never watched it like that. But it was like he ate it over like a new keyboard. <laughs> and they sent him like one giant Cheeto. And it was... And like as he's eating it, he's like, "This is disgusting because there's no more cheese on the outside." Oh, you know, oh yeah. Like, it's so just it's just like styrofoam. Yeah, yeah, styrofoam on the inside. Oh, oh man. What? I watched uh, it like 10, 15 years ago. Yeah, I'm not even kidding. Like, oh, actually, I'm glad that ago. wasn't times because that's what I thought you were going for. Ten or fifteen. <laughs> <years>. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna be very confused. Well, although I do have a question. Uh, was it uh, like a crunchy Cheeto, like, or was it like a cheese puff? No, it was like he opened the bag. They sent it to him. He opened the bag, and it was one giant Cheeto. Mm. It was one point two fucking miles away from that shit. In on number two or number three? Uh, how do I tell? Well, look at the number well, on the, the top. On the top. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And it would be it would be that number minus one. What? On. Oh, stand by. <laughs> It was number three. Wow, mm. dude, that's amazing. So, so where was it? 
Don't. It was in uh, Mexico. Yep. Oh, wow. That's funny because we're doing a Europe only. That's thing. what you think, but Mexico is the new Europe. So there you go. Is that true? There it is kind of, a, it's like a European part of North America. <laughs> That's what I keep saying. <laughs> what? Because they don't yeah, speak English as a primary language. Oh, shit. I didn't even get to make a guess. Oh. Rip. I guessed in Antarctica because I was freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> I just looked up and it said one, so I just clicked on the map and it hit Antarctica, so I got two points. Yeah, that's even like the wrong. That's pretty good. That's, that's the furthest of the ice continents from. <gasps> two points, baby. It's better than my usual zero. <laughs> I have a question. I have an answer. How how often do you guys vacuum your place? Uh, I hire a maid once a week. Kristen does it. Oh, that's a good wow. idea. Wow. Oh my god. Jeez. What? So sexist. Why? If you were looking oh. for justification here <laughs> into like vacuuming our place more, you've come to the wrong place, I think. <laughs> well, I mean, you did say I don't clean my room. I have wife. <laughs> yeah. I didn't say no. Like, I just... Yeah, you did. No, I said yeah. I don't need. I, it, there what? is a nuanced expression involved in it. Okay, <laughs> I can't remember the exact wording, but it was exactly how it was. <laughs> yeah, that's that's pretty much how it was. Yeah. Um, because well, I clean it once a week, but I'm not sure if that's normal or too often. I think it's normal. Yeah, that seems relatively. Normal. I think vacuuming once a week is normal. <laughs> Kill me. Why are you doing that? <laughs> yeah, dude, I feel you. <laughs> um. <laughs> Yeah, uh, yeah, I don't know. I clean. Do you vacuum your place, <laughs> Rob? I do. Yeah, not terribly often, but I should more because I do have like carpets in the, like, <laughs> yeah. pretty much the whole. Why apartment. do I get the yeah. feeling it is terribly often, but just <laughs> in the other interpretation of the word terrible? Oh, so it's just like remove often. Yes, exactly. <laughs> well, no, I'm yeah, not well, saying you do a bad job. Just that yeah. it's probably fairly infrequent. Yeah, it's, it's it's fairly infrequent. How? Like once a month? Yeah, that's probably fair. Probably. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I feel like once a week is fair. Personally. <laughs> I'm with you. I mean, I've never uh, actually vacuumed. You've never used a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I've used it when I was a kid. I was like, oh, that looks fun. But As, <laughs> Since the age of 18, you've never used a vacuum cleaner. I've never used a vacuum what cleaner. What on earth? Time. <laughs> you actually are like every member of the show combined. Like, <laughs> that is incredible to me. Why? All right. Well, I mean, it just like it happens. Like sometimes I just yeah, like I gotta use the vacuum right now. Yeah. What, what you have? Well, like what if you, what if you knock over like some flour? <laughs> Do you think I have flour in my apartment? You don't have flour in your apartment. <laughs> you think I cook? Yeah, it comes <laughs> pre-baked with her grub hub. <laughs> yeah. Do, do we go over this? I don't have anything. People are like, just put aluminum. So like my mic picks up like radio signal. Yeah. They're like, oh, just take aluminum foil. Why would I have aluminum? You don't have aluminum foil? No, I don't have aluminum foil? No, I have it now. I have it literally in front of me because, um, because of this mic thing. But no, what would I need aluminum foil for, ever? To cover leftovers. <laughs> Cook. Yeah, for leftovers. For leftovers. <laughs> Guys, I did really good. How many points yeah. did you get? I got 21,648 points. That is not know. that good. Where's, where's the last Come place, Come on, Josh? dude. Josh, I I'm running out of time. Where is it? It's a Bulgaria. Promise? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh. You promise? Yes, I promise. So Pinky swear. This is not like it's gonna sound like I'm trying to get I'm giving you like enough rope to hang yourself. But what uh, do you actually have in your kitchen? Uh, let, let, I'll just ask I, I, a couple I, I, to kickstart you. Do you have knives? Yeah. You got like a knife block or something? Okay, I, I bought I bought everything because 
my ex boyfriend said he was gonna cook. Okay. I, all my all my exes said they're gonna cook, except for uh, <laughs> well, my current boyfriend, who is okay. exactly like me. Neither of us cook, and it's fine. But yeah, did, all, did, all of them actually told that me that they would cook. Pretense that neither of you cook. Yeah, well, it's good to fine. start honestly. I, I don't yeah. really care. I don't, yeah, I don't yeah. care. But uh, according to like my exes, they're like, okay, like I'll pay, like I pay for the groceries, yeah. and then they'll cook occasionally, and then I'll take get takeout anytime they don't want to cook, right? Like, yeah. I don't mind. And so that's kind of the agreement. Mm -hmm. And they literally cook like once every week, or maybe once a month at like wow. a certain point. Hmm. So I mean, I bought all the like kitchen, I like I have pots, pans, knives, but no one uses that. I don't use it. I've never used any of that. Oh. <laughs> have you <laughs> have you ever boiled water? No. Well, in your life. I have never boiled. My, my parents had one of those. Hold like, on. I can't handle I have never this. boiled that, water. That, I was expecting that to be a joke. Question, I expected but... you to be mad that I asked. To be no, honest. I mean, I, I'm very honest. I don't do. Like, when I say I'm a trash human, I'm literally like. <laughs> I know. Have you ever like, bought you know? like a Stouffer's lasagna and threw that shit in the oven? I don't really get that stuff. <laughs> I usually just get Hot Pockets. Nice. You know? I appreciate Do yourself a favor. Get a Stouffer's lasagna. <laughs> Wait, okay. hold on. Sub question. Sub question. Put it in the oven. Flavor. What? Favorite Pardon? Hot Pocket. Oh, uh, I like the pepperoni pizza ones ah that is incorrect the correct answer, <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> correct answer is ham and cheese okay this is actually like ham and cheese it tastes weird this is and again at one point these questions are gonna you're gonna take offense to one of them because it's gonna go slightly <laughs> too far and that's where we'll stop but you've used a microwave yeah have you ever used an oven no wow really have you yeah, ever? Why would I use an oven? Hafu, <laughs> have you ever made a sandwich? Yes. What kind? I don't know how to have do you that. ever? Have you made ever made a sandwich using deli meats? Yeah. Have you ever toasted said sandwich? Yes, I know how to use the toaster. Have you ever made a grilled cheese? <laughs> no. Really? Well, how do I make a grilled cheese? Yeah. I have a microwave. It's never. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! 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 <laughs> No. That's what I'm saying. If all I can use is a the microwave, then how am I gonna make the grilled cheese? Have you ever made scrambled eggs? I died. No, I've never you, cooked anything. Like you've never, just, you've never, you, you never fried something. I've made decent scrambled no. eggs in a microwave. I don't. I, I actually have never tried to turn on the stove. But you have like you have an oven in your house, your apartment. Yeah, I mean I'm in an apartment. It comes with one. I have to have one. But it's just like a counter. I don't really use the, like our kitchen is always clean because no one uses it. It makes neither actually me perfect nor sense. David well, that's nice, I guess. ever have dishes because we just throw our takeout stuff after. I, I have a question. What if let's say it's like two a.m. and you're really hungry? What I do have soylents, and I have like snacks. <laughs> and what if it's all out? So like you drank the last. It, no, it doesn't. Like I, I can imagine a scenario. I can post Nate someone to go. She yeah, put herself in a situation. Hours. No, I mean if I'm hungry, I eat. I never starve myself. Yeah. Like, like there's always ways to get. Th okay, as I get older, the world allows me to be lazier and lazier. They came out with Uber. <laughs> they came out with Uber Eats. They came out with Twitch. So my fucking career is just you know what I've been doing yeah. since I was 14, which is incredible. Okay, again. Very very grateful. This might be huh? the one that crosses the line. What? I don't know yet. Have you ever like washed a plate? Yes. <laughs> okay. I've, di I've done dishes. All right. Have you ever done it by hand, not a dishwasher? Yes. I actually don't know how to use a dishwasher. So. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm 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 going up by. <laughs> In fairness, I don't have dishes. It's not like I leave. Do you, wait. Do you have Do you have plates? Yeah. I bought everything because remember I told you, you okay. the yeah, boys yeah, right, that I dated right, right, told right. me they would cook and they did occasionally, <laughs> like once every few weeks. Have you ever thought about like what it might be like to use the oven? 
No, I mean, I, I eat well. <laughs> I actually eat question, really dude. well. I, I spend a lot of money on food, and I know it's wasteful for a lot of people. It's mm-hmm. not like I get McDonald's when I when I get yeah. takeout. I get, like, nice meals. Like, expensive. But that's, like, my only Yeah, that's expense. how the, that's, that's how like, the, all I spend that's money on. That's how you gauge the nutrition value is with the expense. <laughs> well, no, but it's, like, it's, like, at a nice place with, like, you know, like, we got a life kitchen. I don't know. That's where I order most of my food. And it's really, really... I don't know. It just tastes like homemade stuff. Yeah. It's just good. Mm. I, mean, I fucking, I respect the shit out of you. Yeah. <laughs> like, you fucking, I don't you believe you, Josh. No, I swear. You like, it's her. fucking, like, I'm impressed. Yeah, what? you're like almost more Rob than I am. <laughs> like, I mean. <laughs> I, just, just, I like that you stick to your guns. Yeah. It's just, it's, I don't know. <laughs> Whatever, hate is gonna hate. This is just how I live. I'm okay with it. It's not like I'm that's asking fair. other people. Yeah, you're like you're owning it. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. So like that's fair. It's mostly. How many points just... did you get, Hafu? Pardon? How many points did you get? Two thousand seven hundred and fifty-seven. Total. You did great. Total? <laughs> Fuck you. Is that total? <laughs> no, it's not. Okay. No, no, no. fourteen thousand. <laughs> okay. I mean, I knew there was like the two points for Antarctica, so I was like, I was trying to be delicate. For, for, <laughs> 14,000, 14,084. I, I got 23,052. Robert. Right. Oh, that's right. fucking Robert. great. I got 23,059. What? Oh, that's, oh, that's so, you guys did so good. Oh, thanks, Josh. I really thought I might have won this one, but I didn't. Well, you can win some Trivia Murder Party, which we'll be back to play in three minutes. Mm. We'll play Trivia Murder Party in three minutes. He's right. Be right back. <laughs> yep. <laughs> that was my segue. You guys, dude, that was pretty that good, was, honestly. Was <laughs> yeah, that was very good. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Oh well, I, what I was gonna ask actually, Hafu, mm. are you averse mm. to like learning how to cook? Like, would you be interested in that at all? No. Oh man. Hmm. You're missing out on so many great YouTube videos. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, the, there's a whole channel yeah. related to this that you can't appreciate as much. Dude, can I just say, like, you Wait. should not, you should not even uh, judge Hafu because Rob, you use freaking paper plates. That triggers me. <laughs> Josh, you didn't even uh, unplug your okay. bathtub when you showered. Okay, I, I didn't unplug. Just, wait, wait, say you that. You guys are like, what? Wait, 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 wait. like you're like one step better, maybe, than Hafu with cooking. But you're like, oh my god, Hafu, you're not even doing that. Oh my god. And then like it triggers me. I want to fight right. all of you right okay, now. Okay, Hold I'm on, not wait. actually scared about that, but I have no you idea didn't what. Me you, up. What are you talking about? I unplugged you... my shower before I took a bath. No, what you, you freaking took a shower with the water being filled up in the bathtub. It was so what you, gross. What are you talking about? I've never done that. You but, did by that. Way, side no. Note. I've yeah. sat down and took a shower without the tub full. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> what are you saying? Without the tub full? Yeah. <laughs> I... I'm saying you took a shower and the water was just being saved inside of the tub because you didn't unplug the tub. What? Are you saying like I did that on purpose? Like I I plugged the tub and I took a shower because it felt good? No, you forgot to unplug the tub to drain the water. Remember, at Tex West, and I was like Rob. I mean not Rob, Josh. It was really gross. <laughs> and then you said, "Well, Kate, okay, just it's okay. Just like unplug it." I I don't remember this, but I wasn't a part of it. I think part of the story. No, I don't think I knew you, Rob. Mm. It was like a long time ago. Mm. Yeah. Um, but Kate, I have bad news for you. Uh, oh no. <clears throat> Hafu also uses paper plates. Well, yeah. That's not my. It's not my. Uh, it wasn't my idea. It was David's idea. So. <laughs> yeah, but you still use them. Yeah. But yeah, she she's like she's all like all in. Like if this is gamble, you guys are like kind of like half betting. <laughs> but she's all in. That's so in a way I respect that because she's she's all in. You know? I am pretty min max in my life. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm not min, saying I don't want to do shit. I'm, I just want to sit. I'm definitely not saying that like my life is more in control than any of yours. It is. I don't I don't know it if that's is. true. I feel like you guys have simplified things in a certain degree. 
Yeah. You, you're willing to do things that I'm not willing to do. <laughs> I'm not willing like to. Like what? I'm like, I'm not willing to eat that much takeout. After eating takeout for like two or three days in a row, I'm like, I got to cook something. I need like, I need to eat some vegetable guts. But. You can yeah. have vegetables. You can order vegetables. What do you mean? Yeah. You can order vegetables. Then I'm I, I mean, bread. the thing about takeout is people assume that you're always just getting junk. Like, it's not like we're getting burgers and pizza all the time. Yeah, but then I'm that's like, what, I'm paying That's what people for think this. about takeout. Wait, when, when I eat a healthy meal that I cook myself, I'm like, this. at least it was cheap. <laughs> like, when I, mm. if I'm paying money for something, I want it to be But you're also spending your time me. on it, right? Yeah, I'm, you know, that's meaningless. And it, this is just going back to that, <laughs> like, oh, if life. Bill Gates dropped $9,999. That's true. I mean, you just spent how many hours? You could have been making videos and making money off that. So you're losing money, well, Ryan, by cooking. Boom. Done. Okay. It's true. I'll, it's actually but then he has a wife. I have I have a life outside of my job, unfortunately. No, I say wife. Yeah, I have a wife and a life. <laughs> well, Not, I mean the second part. More yeah. wife, yeah. Hundred percent I have a yeah. wife, like twenty five percent I have a life. Yeah. But what I was gonna say is like Kate, I know I broke that shelf today, but you gotta be feeling pretty good about the fact that your husband, he's like almost an adult. I know how to use the oven. I'm not showering. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not showering with the tub whatever. Yeah, I don't go really ahead and try to finish I don't that really sentence. know <laughs> what was going on in that part, but <laughs> he didn't he didn't unplug the tub. So what the are you dirty water unplug was the not tub? Drain. <laughs> the bathtub was it was plugged. So the dirty water was just inside of the bathtub. Why is it so hard to understand? All right, all right, all right. Here's your your trivia murder party seed. There's, Where are you putting it? Um, one in <laughs> Skype and one in Discord. <laughs> Where in? Di just put it in the RLS chat. <sighs> Actually, wait. No, we have a we have a room for this now. Uh, there's a there's there's a text chat private called text. Uh, private text. Yeah, put it in there. There you go. Boom. Thank you, sir. Look, I don't fully get it, but... <laughs> you don't have to. I try to... I, I try to... I feel like inside of me, there's like a... Deep inside of you. There's like a degenerate. And I try to keep that degenerate down. I, I do not at all. Yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. Some days I am I, the biggest degen. <laughs> some days I wake up and I'm like, I could just like not eat today. I could just like not eat until 1 a.m. And I'm like, ah, that's not a good idea. I mean, I'm not like that. I eat. I love eating. I haven't eaten since I woke up. See? I did wake up at like 5. So. P.M.? <laughs> A.M.? Uh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Definitely P.M. Yeah. Yeah. Well, What's crazy is that like that's basically as bad as it can get. But because yeah. of our industry, it doesn't seem that bad. Yeah. <laughs> like, so my sleep schedule's so fucked right now. Like, basically, I, I slept until midnight and then couldn't go to sleep until, like, basically, like, 2 p.m. or something. Yeah. And then I slept till 5. Yeah. But does it matter what time you sleep? I feel like we're on, exactly. we've got like the full spectrum here. Hafu is, like, chaotic neutral. She's like, it doesn't matter when you wake up. And I'm like, I don't even know. I'm like lawful good. I'm like, if you wake up after 8 a.m., you should pay penance. <laughs> it just doesn't feel like, like it feels like you've wronged the universe by waking up that late. And then I don't know. Josh is also chaotic neutral. Yeah, I'm I'm chaotic neutral if I'm anything. Okay, maybe we're all actually just chaotic neutral. You're definitely lawful. You're definitely lawful. How am I lawful yeah. evil? You're, you're, because you, you don't let homeless people take out my bottles. Uh, I let dude, them take it out. I just, I laughed was, when he was fell. Was it you, Rob? <laughs> was that you in our garbage room? Yes. <laughs> was that you stealing our bottles? That is the most lawful evil thing that I've ever heard. We left. It wasn't because he was homeless. It was because he fell. <laughs> we, Kate and I laughed. A very rich man. That's yeah. Rich. I would probably Can laugh you? harder if it was like a, a tiny rich guy with a monocle. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, this one's easy. <laughs> oh. 
Oh shit, I don't know this one. What do you mean? I, I don't know. I also, I mean, I, I have no idea, one. but it Jeannie, must Jeannie, be Jade. Mighty Mo! Jo oh, Josh I just thought you think it's Jade? What an idiot. <laughs> yeah, Josh, Josh has no idea. <laughs> <laughs> it's Sasha. <laughs> Was it? <laughs> Josh what got it he? right. Got I saw it. <laughs> it was easy money. Easy money. God damn it. Oh, of course he did. Of course he did. Oh, right. do we have to be watching your stream to be part of it? Not Maybe. for all of them, I think. So not for, I'll let you know when you have to look at the stream. Yeah. For right now, you don't have to. But you, you probably should anyway. So you have John to and quarter. draw. Machu Picchu, and whoever uh, draws draw? it the best doesn't die. What is Machu Picchu? Can I draw with my mouse? You don't get to draw, Josh. Okay. I don't know what to do. So oh, uh, because I got it right? Yeah, you got it right, so you don't okay. need to. <laughs> you guys didn't know it was Sasha, huh? I get confused. Yeah, which one, I guess. Which one's Machu Picchu and which one's uh, Chichen Itza? <laughs> draw the one that is in Egypt. That's the Jeez. that's a pyramid. Oh what? Okay. Well, I didn't. Hmm. What? <laughs> what is happening? There were so many emotions within a second. <laughs> I don't know what Machu Picchu is, so I drew. <laughs> oh my God! Rob's drawing is so good. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. That is good. I mean, it's, it's it's saying pick the Wait, worst drawing. Pick the worst drawing between A and C. So why are there boobs on the top of Machu Picchu? That's an M for Machu. <laughs> ah, no, so the the pyramid There's is a Pichu. <laughs> the right, Pichu yeah. is was inside us the whole time. <laughs> I mean, come on. All right. It's pretty good. Afu, <laughs> your, your cat has been selected as the worst drawing. <laughs> you, you just called that's, Pikachu a cat? That's Pikachu? It's a Pikachu. <laughs> it's a Pikachu, yeah. He's, look, he's just down on his luck. He's been having to scrounge for bottles for a couple of years. You know. Am I dead? Yeah, you're dead now. Oh, you still dead. get to answer questions, though. We've always been dead. <laughs> Is that the drawing? I don't know if that's Ryan's, but it looks like it's a fountain. Yeah, that was mine. Water coming 100%. out of it. People were giving me Ryan for not knowing what Machu Picchu looks like. I got a job after university. I didn't travel. Well, I traveled to my job, but I didn't do the like, yeah, hey, let's go to say, Peru and exactly climb the thing, did. okay? Well, in fairness, I don't travel to my job. Would you do it? Climb Machu Picchu? Yeah. yeah like, not? would you would you like to see the Machu Picchu? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I don't know any of these. Where I where can a fella get a Jamoka shape? Mini, 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 mini. Jamoka, Jamoka. That's got to be Burger Jamoka King. Jamoka, me crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like it. I appreciate it. It's that Arby's. Too. Frig. Yep. What did I well, guess? Yeah, I don't know what I guess. Well, Arby's is great. It's not Burger King or McDonald's. No. What you think? It's, I have never had a positive Arby's experience. I haven't been to Dude, Arby's. I love Arby's. I haven't been Arby's to Arby's is... since I was like four. We don't Arby's have they don't Arby's. Ha they don't really have them in Canada even. There's a few. Lady Grey, do you like Arby's? Uh-oh. Jo it's me and Josh. We gotta type who's your best friend. Alright? I know <laughs> oh, typed it out. Uh oh. Oh no. Someone wrote Ryab and someone wrote Kate. <laughs> Pick the worst answer. <laughs> yep. Kate, I'm sorry, but I think I'm. We're probably going down here. <laughs> I like how you started the show. Like, oh, we've been knowing each other since grade ten. Yeah, I've actually known you longer than you know, Kate. Yeah, that's true. Mm. <laughs> yeah, did you guys ever have sex? I mean, he's yeah. you've known. <laughs> <laughs> With each other? There was or that one just time. in general. Yeah. yeah, well, you know, but both, you know, could be interesting oh, in this conversation. Uh Josh got killed because his answer was more popular. Ah. Uh, I oh. still don't understand how these things Kind of a classic <laughs> trivia murder party. We don't understand why a person died, but hey, lucky me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Still kicking it. Mm -hmm. I think you're supposed to, you're supposed to guess, uh, pick the worst uh, answer. Yeah, it tells you, it's like, hey, pick the worst answer. Yeah, but, like, what's the worst answer to who's your best friend? <laughs> yeah, that's... Any goddamn sense. 
Clearly, the answer was Kate in that instance, though. <laughs> What is David? David after the dentist? dentist? You know, it's the. Oh, I remember this. It's a classic viral video. Yeah. I, remember, I remember this. I, remember I this. have never seen it. You have definitely seen it. You have seen it. You have nope. seen it. I've seen it. If I've seen it, I never seen it. So. Hafu, I guarantee I've seen less shit. No, no. I don't think yeah. so. I don't think so. I actually don't think says so. my face feels funny? Not, yeah, I don't remember life? that. That's why, that's why that's like a thing yeah, now. Yeah, he said. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, it's never uttered! Never. Okay, I didn't read that. Okay, Alright, you guys all get to put some poison in one of those glasses. And I... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Alright, everyone put it in four. Okay. No, no, you wanna poison him! Just put it in four. Unless Trust me. Okay. Okay. Let's get to the poison... Now it's your turn to play. I bet those are really hard to clean. Poison? I drank no, from Chalice like... one. Now let's see yeah. What Did you die? Let's see. D oh, yep. yeah, I put poison there. Yeah, I'm dead. Get fucked. <laughs> 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 yeah, suck on that. Well, wow, we actually put poison in three different you ones. You guys did a really good job. We are so good. I outthought oh, myself. I was going to take two because it was the least remarkable Chalice, and then I was like, no. Because Rob would originally think he'd put it in two, but then he'd think, no, nobody's going to go for the outside, so he'd put it in one instead. And I was like, mm. Right, we didn't get to see the chalices, we just clicked one, two, three, or four. I'm on, I, I'm on his stream now. <laughs> yeah, I didn't, we didn't get to see the chalices today. <laughs> so I really also, outthought myself. I yeah, also did, put but. the poison in three, so... <laughs> People who suffer from Riley Day Syndrome can't... Wow. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's easy. What? Yeah. Extremely easy you know questions. Mm -hmm. Is it? Josh has all four of these. Well, except for number two. He <laughs> 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 cannot, cannot pass gas. That's all I do. Yeah. If there is a reverse is syndrome for that, I would have it. Let's go. Feel pain. And there is definitely a reverse syndrome. Yeah, there. yeah, absolutely. A probably like ear to low bowel. Anal fissures. Yeah, that would, that would probably how do it too. How, I got a couple of how many cars are needed for the route from Seattle to Portland to San Francisco to LA in the board game Ticket to Ride? Ticket to Ride. Uh, ticket to Ride. If there's a board game called Ticket to Ride. Oh, it's a good one. Ticket to Ride. Ticket pretty fun. Based ticket on that classic ride. Beatles song. Beetlejuice. She's got a... Yeah. Ticket to ride. <laughs> She's got a friend in me. <laughs> I don't want to get sued, so. <laughs> the, correct is... the correct answer is nine. Eh, we all got oh. it wrong. Oh. Okay. I said ten. <laughs> I ask. I want to show you something. We should have bought that game. Dude. It was ninety-nine dollars. It was so expensive. Ticket to ride. Ninety-nine dollars. It was up there. Yeah. Oh, Rob, you got to memorize the pattern that's on the screen. Oh, shit. All right. Uh, what is the order of weapons? Oh, I didn't know that that was what it was. Okay, so... Board games are, like, very expensive oh. in general. I, I played this really fun one uh, called Starship, uh, Star Trucker, Galaxy Star Trucker. Galaxy <laughs> Truck. No, Galaxy. Was it uh, Space Truck Express or something? Space, Space Food Truck. Yeah, what the fuck was it? Space Food Truck. You, you like build your ship? It's really fun. The oh, ship food. Galaxy just... Truckers. <laughs> oh. Dude, I'm dead. we didn't even get to play the final round because we, we all We didn't died. even get to play the <laughs> Chat won. I didn't know that could happen. Yeah. Chat, you did it. Wow. What is this called, Galaxy Trucker? You've played it? I've never really played it, fun. but I hear good things. It is so fun. Wait, what but is then it? I played FTL and I was like, wait, it feels like they just ripped this off FTL. FTL, FTL is after. amazing, though. Yeah, that's I'm hooked on it, but I'm still playing right now. Uh, I've only been it once. That's not Only's that bad, trucker? honestly. Is it Spaceship Trucker? No, no, it's Galaxy Trucker. But is what it happened? Spaceship Michael's? Trucker, though? I didn't watch The Godfather. It's so a great movie. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger, by God damn masterpiece. 
There's no Citizen Kane. That's it, Rosebud. It's no Ready Player One. I liked I like Mysterium. That's a fun board game. Do you like Mysterio, the villain who wears a uh, yes, fishbowl on his head? Yes, absolutely. Mis dude, Mysterio fucking needs justice in like, a Spider-Man movie. Like, he should be in a movie. That would be great. He's a great villain. <laughs> I, I feel like if they gave Taika Waititi Spider-Man and then gave him Mysterio, that could be a good movie. That would be oh, fantastic. No. Hafu, I think you got to look at the screen. Okay. We got to memorize the pattern of blood. Okay. Blood patterns. Does anyone have like a photo? What was it called? Photographic, Photographic memory. memory? No. Mm. Oh, but because it's not the lens. <laughs> <laughs> this is so dumb. Okay, well, I got it right. Oh, so, no, I'm. <laughs> Papa, you're the cheat. I am <laughs> not even close. <laughs> it's not even my fault. I don't. Uh, you just don't look at the other thing. <laughs> well, right Hoffa oh, got a hundred percent, and we won't <laughs> we won't talk about uh, how I did. <laughs> Man, that's so bad. I was, I was, I'm honest. I mean, it's just right there. What do you want me to do? Not look. Yeah, well, you're honest, and I'm dead. So uh, seems real fair. <laughs> and that's game theory. <laughs> <laughs> How? You should just open up your own stream, right? Yeah, yeah you, you should. You should just that. With blackjack and hookers. Mm -hmm. How old are the horses at the Kentucky Derby? I did not know they were all. I the didn't same know they were age. Yeah. Yeah. What, is... what? Really? What's the Kentucky Derby? Yeah, I don't know. It's a horse. Race. That's when they all like wear funny hats and watch horse. Okay. Yeah, I just want to say three years. years. I think three years is too old. I think they're too. No, nope, they're three years old. Hell yeah! Nice. Let's go. I guess three. Feels good. I guessed dose. Me and you, Josh. What are we gonna do? I don't are know. Are you be best friends again, or are you gonna <laughs> do crazy? <laughs> it's just you, and you have to cut one of your fingers off. All right. I don't think. Oh, that, that means you can't guess it. You wait, can't in real play. life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Easy peasy. Yeah. 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 You, you, you aren't allowed to guess whichever which? finger you cut off. Choose which finger to cut off. Um. What? Wait, wait. Just what if you don't guess? What if you don't pick one? Maybe you can outsmart the game. Maybe it chops off all four. It's saw. Then. Yeah. Maybe you just die. It's saw. Don't pick one. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Conscious, conscious to center. Yeah. Conscientious to center. Exactly. Some people just don't listen to instructions. Oh, they killed you. <laughs> oh, that's it. <laughs> I, I was gonna say, they're probably gonna kill him. That was a cake. I, I'll lay down my life for you, Ryan. <laughs> that's not how it happened in Until Dawn. Oh, or man. The Walking Dead. Yeah, exactly. Let's try Did Almost a Josh or a Ryan die in Walking Dead? I enjoy really funny We're not supposed to talk about The Walking Dead anymore? Being. <laughs> oh, really? well, I, I ruined it for everyone. Paul Sheldon yeah. is a character from which Stephen King novel? Oh, obviously it's Big Bang Theory. <laughs> What's the first thing that I thought? Yeah. <laughs> Not gonna lie. You mean sodium chloride, mother? <laughs> hey, how many people in chat love young Sheldon? <laughs> oh man, what a show, am I right? Yeah. On CBS, America's Most Watched Network. Oh shit, I did not get this right. It was misery. That's okay. what I said. I did not say that. that as well, yeah. I said it. Yeah, I, did, I, I didn't say no, that. No, it is called Pennywise. Penny. Oh, it's, it's the arithmetic round. Answer as many math questions as you can before time runs out. <laughs> well, this is where I die. Everyone well, else will be playing too. If anyone what? does better than okay. you, you die. Is that a minus sign? Yeah, is that a, is that an equals? You guys okay? Yeah. I don't know what this is. What it looks I mean? like it equals. I, I no, it's minus. I think. Don't kill me, fuck. I'm frozen. Good. <laughs> Isn't that so annoying? I got my game face Make on, dude. Most of your limited math okay. You're not killing me this time. <laughs> I'm frozen. I refuse to die. I died. 
No, I'm actually just dead, huh? I got, I got 25. <laughs> Holy shit! How do you have so many? <laughs> oh my god. I was stuck on the second one because I, did, I didn't know if it was a minus sign as well. So I just like stared at it. That's, that's for dancing lights. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I mean... That was a fun one. Th those are like my favorite ones. I like those. Rob, you did good. How did you Why? guys get eight and nine? <laughs> Alright, dude. I'm just, I'm not trying to be like rude, but... Look, I'm, I'm blowing I away the trivia, but I'm I hate not that. a mathematician. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm no I math. haven't taken a math course since high school. Yeah, but that's like, it was adding and subtracting. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, no, because it was actually equals, so like, there is- Oh, that's a tricky signs, one. The equals yeah. operator is one of the hardest ones out there. It is! <laughs> Especially when the answer's not there. 7 minus 1, or 7 equals 1, is just wrong. Like, there's no answer for just wrong. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> 7 equals 1 is a tough expression. <laughs> yeah! It is, it is wrong. You're not wrong. Yeah. In that. He is correct. Seven equals one equals Game. X. So. <laughs> <laughs> so. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was Shelby. Someone has to live, okay? Someone yeah, has Rob, to live. stay alive here. I will try. Stay alive. A compass and a square, scroll, candle, or rope. Uh. Boom. You guys in the stonemasons? Yeah. Oh yeah. Big into oh, okay, it. Okay, yeah. me too. Cool. Yeah. yeah Just making yeah. sure we're all cool. Stone yeah. temple masons. Chilling with the with the, the lizard people. Rod, you know? you're a god. <laughs> Thank you for answering correctly. It was a square. I have I not. Square. I have not failed a trivia prompt so far. In this game. You got a huge head start. <laughs> Rob, I'm oh. proud of you. Dude, okay, so Rob gets this question by himself. I was watching Buzzer on Twitch uh, the other day, the game show channel. They have Family Feud on, and you know, we've given some bad Family Feud answers in our life, but they had a guy on in Fast Money. Ray Combs, the host, says, name a cut of steak. You know what this motherfucker says? Medium rare. I was losing my mind. There's a, there's a game show Twitch? Yeah. Yeah. Can I enter on and be a contestant? No, it shows replays of game shows from like the eighties. Well, unless you have a time if machine. If you have a time machine yeah, in theory, you could go back and get on an episode that in, they bought the rights for. In game theory? <laughs> yes. Exactly. He also they also said name a month where you get your tax return, and he said January. You can. It got zero. It's like one of the least likely months to get a tax return. No, I think, like, sometime after that would be. No, because your taxes are due <laughs> in April. <laughs> I believe I have gotten this wrong. I am a moron, Wait. yeah. I also said it, Unagi was a shellfish. Wait. Mm. I clicked it all. Oh Hafu God. got them all right. Wait, none of them, right? You're right, yeah. You guys want to use sushi? That's I love sushi, but when it said unagi in my head, I it's went eel. sea urchin, but you're right, it's eel. Uh, that's uni. Eel, yeah. yeah, that's uni. Unagi I didn't eel. actually read the thing, I was just oh, like, this is, what is do what oh, Not like the other. This is an easy one. This is an easy one, yeah. motherfucker. I don't know if this is right, actually. You, after, can you tell me if do what is what I think? Do what is. is a water Pokemon. Like it's that seal looking. That's no, that's seal. That's dugong. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yes. Well, I yeah. still guess correctly. You got it correctly. right, and I got it wrong. <laughs> Do that's like a like a beaver <laughs> thing. It, this, there's no way the snake in the Jungle Book is called Sir Hiss, right? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. I hope so because I'm I'm with that. Come on. I think I got this wrong. It's too. I think Sir Hiss is the real name. Is it? It's a pretty good name, man. I think so. Oh, it's an There's zero percent chance. That it's <laughs> All right, it was none of them. <laughs> what? Oh, damn it! Yeah, I, I, I didn't know that. Sir, fucking Not his. His. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't also know. I, don't know. Know. I fucking I went with them all. 
Dude, there's yeah. no I mean, way. That's pretty good. I'm, I did all of them. There's too. no way fish food. No, is. it is. Fish no, food I think is. fish food is fish definitely food the one. Is. Yeah. Damn it. Fish food is top tier. <laughs> fish food is the best flavor. Fuck. Yeah. God damn. What is in fish food? I don't know. But I just know other Probably people talk like about it, and I'm like, that sounds weird. I don't really want to try it. Yeah, I don't want that at all. African deserts. African oh. deserts. Oh. No, Antarctica it, desert, right. that's the one. Antarctica desert, wait. <laughs> African deserts, I got confused. I also thought I said African desserts. <laughs> <laughs> Sir Hiss. There's not a, a desert called the Antarctica desert in Africa, right? Oh, there it is. It can't be. Is there, there actually? Is. Yep. None of them is the correct what? answer. Okay, thank God. <laughs> you got none of them? I just I guessed the first one. It looked, it looked real. Atacama is a real oh. desert, but it's not okay, Yeah, it's in South uh, America. Uncultured swine. <laughs> Left-handed NBA players. Oh, man. Oh, Chris oh, no. Bosh, is he the one that has, like, that great free throw? <laughs> it looks, like, real weird. He's just kind of like... I have no idea. Uh, I gotta check that now. Fish food is chocolate flavor with chocolate fish in it. Mm. Chocolate fish. Is it chocolate... Just, oh, caramel, marshmallow, gross. and chocolate fish. Just Chris Bosch. Oh, fuck. You That's how he has friends. the great free throw. Go ahead, Kate. You know, in France, they now, like, the trend is to eat bugs. Really? Mm-hmm. Like, mm. they would actually safely farm, like, mealworms or, like, grasshoppers or something like that. And then they would have them be in chocolate bars or, like, uh... They will grind it up and then put it in like a pasta. But you say pasta too! <laughs> <laughs> Canadians. What? Wait, does lasagna count as a pasta? Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh. I don't understand. <laughs> well, how do you say pasta? You guys know what tartufo is? Pa pa pasta. 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 God, I don't know any of this either. But I got it right! You still went ahead of me? <laughs> yeah, That's I know. bullshit. The 12 apostles of how, Jesus. How do you say pasta? Hmm? Pa pasta. Pasta. Pasta? No, it's not pasta! Stop! It's, it's pasta. No! It's pasta. Pasta. pasta, exactly. But you said pasta. Let's go, Thomas is an apostle. Wait, Ryan says pasta? You say pasta, too. I said pasta. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's gonna be close. Except this is, like, the easiest answer for Robert of all time. Mmm. Yes. <clears throat> is Camembert a cheese wrapper? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I don't know. Camembert. <laughs> what if I say like this? Camembert. That's stupid. That makes, makes it sound way more cheesy. Yeah, it's all three. Oh, God it? damn it! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I passed you and escaped. Oh, you <laughs> motherfucker. Left your dead ass behind because you don't know Camembert is a cheese. Never heard of Camembert. <laughs> I didn't survive. Camembert. I also did not survive. Why, did, why is like your final score given to you in dollar amount? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, oh, it's like a brie kind of thing. Yeah, that's why I would. Yeah, it's like it's a bakeable cheese. You don't like brie? It's so good. I'm a, I'm a big brie, brie fan. Yeah. Oh, I love brie. Damn it. You ever bake it? No. Oh, you can bake a brie. Absolutely. Yeah. I gotta try it again someday. Last time I tried it, like, I ate some of the waxy outside. Yeah. Was like, well, don't disgusting. eat the waxy outside! You can eat that's, the waxy that's outside! That's like eating the peel of an orange and be like, oh, that's like gross. You can eat like, the what? wax, though. You can eat the waxy outside? <laughs> that's not Sarah Koenig is the host of which podcast? Galaxy Who? Brain. Instalock. This is my people! I have no idea. Ryan, can you yeah. do it? did you ask me recently about this podcast? Absolutely, oh. I did. <laughs> nice. I hope, I hope you're not lying. It's cereal. Nice. Damn it! Damn it! Dead already? Now. I don't want to die already. <laughs> yeah. You were so excited that that tipped me off. Hundred percent, dude. Hundred percent. That's why you're my best friend. Yep. Even though if it's not the other way around. Yeah, it's not like a mutual. Oh no, it's yeah. Hafu and Rob in the Burn the Money game. Oh, where... the money? <laughs> you gotta burn If it. no one takes the money, no one dies. If you do take the money, 
everyone who doesn't take the money dies. If everybody takes the money, you all die. So what's the point of getting the money? Let's just not take the money, Hapu. But if you get the money, then like you are like close to the end. Yeah, you both took we're the both money. Dead. Yeah. I know. Of course, we're both gonna take the money. Yeah. Thank you, Hapu. <laughs> yes, that is the correct decision. I think if me and Josh ended up with it, we'd both live. Yeah. Hundred percent of the time. Well, yeah. which one of you is the sucker? Nobody's the sucker. We both <laughs> live. <laughs> no, what if one person gets the money. Nobody gets the money. Nobody no, gets the if money if you both don't get the uh, money. No, uh, you have to take the money then. You have to. <laughs> yeah. Well, see, like it, it sucks correct. because I would have, I would put Ryan in a position What's where he now? would, well, would he could take the money and I would still. No, be, no, 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 yeah. no, no. It's always wrong to not take the money. It's actually just, that's just, you take it. She yes. is correct. But yes. you both died. <laughs> but we have money. <laughs> <laughs> It's, there's there's two other players in the game that were not a part of the money situation, and by both taking the money, you lost relative to them. Uh, yes. Austin! So mad. His name is this Howard is Phillips. Yeah, I got it! In fact, it just sounded like the most name name. We all got it, except for oh. Joshua. Yeah, fuck Josh. Wow, alright. <laughs> <laughs> I've done nothing but cheer you on and call oh! you higher in- <laughs> What? <laughs> alright, it's the loser spin. wheel. It just fucking says good luck and then I click spin. <laughs> His name's actually Hewlett Packard. Death, 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 or life. You could, you could do this. I believe in you, Josh. Nah, he, he's pretty much dead center on the death part. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, it was a good run. <laughs> oh, welcome, no. welcome. Oh no, you have to make it! Now I gotta get them all right. That was question We're two. We're not gonna make <laughs> it. No, we ain't gonna make it. We're not gonna make it to the end. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> More questions about cereal. Let's mix things up a little bit. With nice. Your question. No. Weird. Whoa. Me and Half are both dead, the dead the yet we're tied for first in money. Study yep. this yep. photo. <laughs> Remember <laughs> as much as you best. can. <laughs> oh Lord. Let us know. I mean, who do you have to kill in the music industry to get Study this photo. Who do you have to kill? Okay. Do I have to study it? No. Because it says study this photo. Which song and the you said do I have to study it? Sometimes not all games are for me. <laughs> oh, we were supposed to study it? Yeah, we were. <laughs> oh my god. Oops. Sometimes the games aren't for everybody. Yeah, he's got The questions point. are always for everybody. My oh, dude, that's a not a fucking oh. question. That's a life or death game. <laughs> this is. <laughs> <laughs> this is a question. <laughs> I'm gonna put a question in your face. Oh, it head. was Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, you died? I got, I got that. I got it. In fact, the only person oh, who nice. didn't get it was Josh. Son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> I hope you've been keeping up with current events. Which U.S. president was embroiled in the Teapot Dome scandal? What the fuck? What the hell is the teapot dumb scandal? I do Dude, you guys don't know this. I really hope it's Calvin Coolidge. G. <laughs> I was friends with Calvin Coolidge. Oh no. Apparently it's Warren G. Harding. Damn it, that was my second choice after Woodrow Wilson. Yeah, I picked four. Woodrow Wilson was involved in a, a nearly equally scandalous situation. You might know it as the First World War. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's true. Words. I like words. Yeah. Let's do it. I did it all for the words. Yeah, the words. If you if you can't find at least a seven-letter word, you'll be punished. Oh. Well, I can't. Oh, yeah. See, this game is just for you. Shut up. It's not fair. Oh, that one's fun. I want to do that one. Do they have to be by each other? Or you just pick. Letters? No, 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 anything. Ooh, I got one for you. Your 
are almost out of time. <coughs> Juvenile. Yeah, yeah, I saw that too. But speaking of, I see spunk. You can do ing, and then you can just put anything in front, and it's like super easy. I put peekers. <laughs> what are you talking? That's not a word. Peekers is not a word. Peekers. Peekers is a word. That is a word. Yes. I don't know why that's not a yeah, word. Yeah, that's a word. <laughs> Dictionary.com. No. <laughs> you really should have done juvenile though, because I did say that out loud. Yeah, but that's cheating. <laughs> Do you mean peeper? Oh, yeah, it's it not is. a word. It's only I a word in Rainbow Six. Wait, is a peeker not? That's not a word. That's someone who peeks. <laughs> I feel like that should be a Thank word. You. Call up Webster or Miriam. Yeah, I mean in Miriam Webster, like. Uh, G R R L is a word, What's so I feel like peeker. Can Wait, like, be like, is in the a girl who has power? Uh, I believe that is what it is. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, like the the the, the word G R R L. It has no vowels. It's in the dictionary. Is it just grill without the I? What is the name of the scary uh, basically? Who warns Jake All right. Gyllenhaal what is the name of the scary rabbit who warns Jake Gyllenhaal about the end of the world in the movie Donnie Darko? Easy. Ooh, I actually don't know this. Or do I? I don't fucking know, man. This movie sucks. Uh, it, I like it. It's really not your style of movie. That's yeah. yeah. Cause Stone Cold Steve Austin isn't in it. Yeah, <laughs> and he's not murdered. Like it's not like 100 people dropped out of a plane. Yeah, and had to get murdered by Stone Cold Steve Austin. Dude, so like Con Air. That would be a sick movie. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, The Condemned was good. Frank. Yeah, yeah his not. name is Frank. Oh, it's that. the Money Game. Okay. Oh God. Well, Hapu. Wait, who is it? Is it me and you, Ryan? No, it's you and Hapu. Me and you. Hapu. But it's a different. It's different <laughs> rules. Money. It's rock paper scissors this time. Oh. Go rock. Sword, scissors, okay. money. Sword, shield, money. Shield beats sword, shield. sword beats money, money beats shield. Alright. Defend yourself. <laughs> Let's both get money. Alright, grab the money? Yeah. Alright. You're gonna kill me, aren't you? No! Okay. I'm okay. grabbing the that money. That would be the smart decision. He's gonna kill you. Oh yes, my god! Yeah. <laughs> he, that is the correct decision, yeah. He used his sword to destroy Why would you? Wait, we could both have money! Yeah, yeah, but like, I decided to murder you. <laughs> <laughs> that is the exact reason you take the money, actually. In the other one. The but exact reason. I, and technically, I did take the money. That's true. Oh my god. You held gosh. it briefly and then he took the money. <laughs> I, I, wait, look. You still have no money. I actually got money. Yeah, you don't you don't get money in My corpse has money, so fuck you, Josh. Good point. Yeah, that's I deserve that. I'm not gonna lie. I remember this. Yeah. I do apologize. But she's actually a delightful celebrity. I shouldn't have done that. We should have punched our money and then I know, I, I, I agree. Why I, did you do, that? do it again? I couldn't help myself. David the company and Taya Leone have a child with one unusual name. Fuck, please be Philip. Pilot Inspector. I think it's Pilot <laughs> Inspector. I actually I think it is. Yeah. Is it really? Alright, well, I picked it, so no one else No, I, I'm picking four. Cause Kid that's with a, a Y. Name. Yeah, that's a dumb name, so let's just <laughs> see it. It, it's kid like with a Y. Oh, oh fuck no. Yeah. Are you sure it's not pilot <laughs> inspector? Can we go back and ask him? Oh, it's some money. Guess what? <laughs> I still have money. It's the money one. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. Right. You get in the money game with Rob, you might as well just... Say your prayers. <laughs> I, I, if you guys all want to not take no, money, oh, this one is that. take as sure take as much are. money as you want. If you take the most or the least, you'll be sorry. Ah, okay. Oh, I like this game. Uh, I made a terrible mistake. I did too. <laughs> Did you? Yeah. I, oh, yeah. I definitely took the most. I mean, I went with the only logical I am choice. actually extremely mad at Josh. Did you choose 69? Josh took 69. <laughs> I knew you would! Yeah. <laughs> I knew you would! I yeah. before I saw it. Oh, my God. Get wrecked! I don't I, know why. It's like, it's like 420 and 69 or 1 through 
<laughs> so if I'm you ever play in that game with Josh, just take 70. Yeah. <laughs> I can't believe you guys didn't take take the only logical choice there. Wait, what happens if we all chose 60? The logical oh my god, your corpse still took the money! <laughs> yeah, okay. is my corpse more- That's true. Wait, my corpse has $69? <laughs> That's fucking rad! <laughs> That's real good! If someone says that you were as old as Methuselah in a literal sense, then how old are you according to the Bible? Well, Methuselah, he's like, oh. <gasps> that one has 69 in it. Does it's clearly yeah. the right answer. I actually think that is the right answer as well. Really? I think so. 969 okay, think so years? That's ridiculous. 767? I could believe it. <laughs> Bring on 69. And the correct answer is. Papu, I'm sorry that I murdered you. No, Man, no, that too late for apology. 969 was the correct answer. I told you. Always go 69. On what continent would you find Patagonia? That's 69 can dine. Oh, I know this one. I don't know this one. I'm gonna guess this. Actually, the, the answer is definitely North America if you look outside in the wintertime <laughs> because they make coats. At <laughs> Patagonia? You ever hear that? That's stupid. <laughs> I don't like it. Get the hell oh, out. Oh, I got it wrong. Feels bad. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm already dead. So yeah. It's okay. Only Rob has to get it right, and he got it wrong. Rob, rip. Did he get it right? Nope. Man, that was a bad. We suck. Decision. Yeah, we're we bad. Yeah. I did good. Rob, you got patterns. You got to remember the pattern. All Rob, right, I can huh? help you. Yeah. Well, I mean, this would be pretty easy. Yeah, the stream, we should so. all help you. <laughs> I got colors. It's a pattern. You got to remember the. I got the weapons. Okay. Oh, what blue, I, green, blue, green, yellow. Blue, green, blue, green, yellow. Blue, green, blue, green, or orange, whatever. Yeah, yeah. It's not. You, you mind flooded me there with that yellow. Mind flooded. <laughs> Hammer, sword, sword, grenade, grenade. Mm -hmm. All right, Rob lives, so we all live. Hell Rob, yeah! I'm proud of you. Thanks, man. No, thank you for being here tonight. Oh, thanks. I, I got, super gotta go right at six. Very fair. So I gotta go play in a poker tournament. Ooh. Are you, ooh. Like. What kind? What kind Wait, of poker? It's a heads up, like, Before half that, I just oh, want to go. Half not. Tournament? Yeah, yeah. It's like a 32 person, or 16 person? 16, 16. person. 16 person. It's Jason what? Carver, uh, single limb heads up. I cannot do heads up. It's, it, I mean, I don't know how to play poker very well. What but... is? I don't know what that is. I don't know any heads, of heads up people. is one on one. The the hold'em changes to like a completely different game in heads up. It's oh, like, and like the rules are different or something. No, the rules no, are no, the no, same. But oh, how you play is different, right? Because there's yeah. only one person. Maybe how you play like when you is play different. with six to eight people. Oh my god! I just, the actual worst thing you could do. Nice. Anyway. Uh, um, but you just have to play like way looser and just read one person. Mm. It's like much yeah. easier because you're gonna have the best hand half the time. Because yeah, because there's only two two hands. Like any two, card sounds value pretty normal changes. to me. I'm I'm used two to that. Value. No, like do seven might be good in heads up. Like so, like you kind of you play the hand values just like change completely. What happens when your deuces are wild? <laughs> it's a, it's a what happens game. when the deuce is loose? Uh, that means you shit your pants. Oh, yeah. That's what they used to say when Deuce Daily played for the Steelers. Deuce is loose? Yeah. They used to say the juice is loose when OJ was found not guilty. Oh, maybe guilty. that's what I was thinking of. <laughs> this categories requires dice? Yep. Ah, shit. For the letter. For the letter. You roll for the letter. All right, the new meta so is actually 26 not, just, just die? not picking any of them and seeing what happens. <laughs> Dude, I'm terrible at this version, this part of the game. Oh, oh. Oh. Yo. Oh, uh, Yo, well, okay, but yeah. the Green Wait, Ranger right. was not Wait, original. Yeah. I'm well, saying it's not original. But he is part of the original series, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, which Correct, is Correct, but he wasn't it. one of he the- He wasn't one of the original Power Rangers. He shows up really? in like episode 11 or something. Ad, he was, yes, he was not part of the original five. That's but bullshit. But he was Did that in count? Mighty that's, Morphin Power. That's Rangers. absolutely baloney. Yeah, but confirmed. Haha. -ha. That's kabasa. And I got it. <laughs> <laughs>
Matthew That's McConaughey films in which he plays a lawyer. The Weekend at Bernie. I've seen all of these. I don't know any of these. I don't think I've seen Bernie. I'm just gonna say none. Boom. In... Do you guys like Weekend at Bernie's one or two better? I haven't seen either of them. Why? Because <laughs> I was too busy watching the Lincoln lawyer. He doesn't play a lawyer in Bernie, he plays a sheriff! Maybe that's not true. Mm. Guessing none was not a good not not a good one there. Ah shit. Oh shit, what the hell is this? I mean, I don't know, probably. <laughs> Which one what the fuck is Hugo? Is that Hidalgo? Like this Yep, that's the sequel to Hidalgo. Yeah. They, they were like, what if we took a doll out of the center and just put a U in there instead? That... <laughs> the Peanuts movie was released in 3D. Yeah, you didn't know that? It's a 2D much... film. Anything in 3D. after All of them? 2005 was released in 3D. <laughs> Mr. Popo? Yeah, oh, Po know, is dude. not a, Rome, a Greek alphabet letter. That's a Teletubby. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I should know this. I was in a sorority, and somehow I don't know the last one. Was it Po Po Po? <laughs> Gamma Phi Beta. Oh. That was kind of... mm. I, I was too gonna be in a frat, but yeah. I didn't go back to college the second year. Mm. Thank God for that. Um. Oh. Boy. It's not the capital of Scotland, right? Galway is Irish, you Philistines. It is. It well, is so the then, cap it's the so, capital of Scotland. So what I said is correct. It's <laughs> the capital of Scotland. <laughs> and also, really? I was referring to Rome, right? So. <laughs> oh, Ahafu. What? You got the inverse. Oh, did I get a zero? <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. Wait, I did click. Did it say which isn't? Yeah. How did you get- I got oh, it all right! Oh, I was like, I got it all- <laughs> no, no. Ah, Oh, because so whoever's in first doesn't get the last answer, so the people in- Correct. Yeah. Yeah. It's annoying. Well, this is bad for me, though, because I can't get- Or maybe I'll escape? Not bad. I, I, I saw the inverse. Oh, yet another escape for me. <laughs> oh, you motherfucker. If you give me uh, the kill shot on a food question, oh. I'm not going to let you down. <laughs> mm. uh, I'm so bad. Oh, not as bad as me noise. <laughs> Except Josh kills me anyway, so, you know. <laughs> it, in the end, we're all just stardust, and we all died anyways, Hafu. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Hafu, why don't you take okay. a second to uh, pimp your channel, because you gotta, you got to go okay. win some money. I'm Hafu. I'm streaming. Oh, I'm actually gonna stream a lot of Hearthstone, but I've been streaming faster than light. I've never played that before. I'm gonna stream Into the Breach coming up. Oh. Thank you, check me out. Mm -hmm. TV slash It's Hafu. Thank you for having me. Thank you for being and here. And not uh, judging like me Hafu. too much, right, guys? No judging me too much with my lifestyle choices. Anyway, thank you so much <laughs> for having me. See you guys. See ya. See ya. Okay, you wanna hop in for uh, one more game? Oh. Uh, I'll, I'm I'm gonna be bad. I don't know anything. I don't read Wikipedia during my free time. Wow. So I will <laughs> I will beat I will beat Halfless record for like being worse than her. It's up to you. Where where where's the link? I will create a new game. Mm okay. Mm okay. Mm okay. Mm okay. Mm -hmm. I'm, I was like falling asleep a little bit because my I think like what happened was like the rush of blood to like finish building the furniture and now I'm just kind of dying like I'm at the <laughs> the lowest point of my life right now I'm just like oh my god I feel like I need to <laughs> I need to just like pass out that's how oh, I feel yeah. right now there is the code it's in private text in Robert's discord Ooh, it kind of sounds like an actor's initials almost. Mm, yep. <laughs> Meryl Streep. Private text. That's it, you got it. Right. Jack. Kind of? I, I think, I yeah. It's all mixed Jack, up. Jackbox.tv? Yeah. Correct. 
Tell me when we're all in, and then I'll say the thing. And then you put in that. Oh, she's in. I'm Let's in. go. Sit back and relax. That's <laughs> what I need to do right now. It's it's Robert Jowney Dooney. <laughs> <laughs> Robert Robert Jowney Dooney. What? Yeah, Robert Jowney Dooney. <laughs> How come you got a VIP? Um, because I was the first one in. That's that basically allows me to be the person who clicks the button that says play again. Is that exciting? Yeah, what's that like? It's nice for me to have control because I don't trust you guys with that level of responsibility. On, I wouldn't trust me there. with anything. Yeah. That dog was, was had human hands. <laughs> <laughs> what? The dog, he had a human hands. Yeah. What dog? Okay. There's a dog. I'm not gonna a see the I'm not gonna see the the chat. Mm okay. I'm going for idea. I'm going for a high score of zero right now. Well you got your you got your first questioning right there. I thought it was cadmium. <laughs> ah fuck if I know dude, I've never heard of this. I think I got this one correct. I'm like sixty nine percent sure. I thought it was cadmium. No. Well, I'm gonna guess that it's not cadmium because it's not available to kids. It's mercury poisoning. <laughs> I was okay. only Josh. Oh got it. damn it! I all right. To pick mercury. What happens if we where? all died on that one? Does the game just end? I don't know. Please, not the money. No, because you play to see uh, who dies. Drawn and quartered. Make me feel something. Mm. something Draw smelly, something it smelly. Draw this thing as best as you can and press send when you're finished. <laughs> Draw Ryab. Hey. Laughing at the homeless man. And make the Again, homeless man stinky. I didn't laugh because he was homeless. I laughed because he that's fell down. Did. That's what you told me. That's what that's you said. Kate and I watched did, an old yeah. Japanese lady fall off her bicycle in Japan. And we laughed. Did you, uh... No, we did not laugh. We were like, "Holy shit! What should we do?" And then all the people around her, oh my! And then they they helped her up, and I was like, "Oh my god, we should have done that." Oh. Except oh, so we were really laugh. stunned. So you were you were those people that were just like, "Oh, wh what do we do? Freeze!" Oh, how how tragic! <laughs> and you turn around and walk away. <laughs> so like, really, it was the only thing that laughed was Ryan. <laughs> oh shit! Pick the worst drawing. <laughs> I think one is not alike from the other. <laughs> yeah, one of them has a butt. <laughs> hey, that's not a yeah. nice thing to say about your face. <laughs> I did not choose Ryab's face, because that's one of the better ones. Yeah, I, I drew my own face, and it was so good that I got killed. <laughs> that's crap. Yours was good. The other two were crap. Literally. Well, it was yeah. the worst. You got it. Yeah, you got it. <laughs> because you're the worst. I messed up the joke. Mm. Yeah, I just forgot it. It's a scoreboard, okay? It's a scoreboard. That's good. Oh, let's see how the audience is. Mm -hmm. good. The audience is definitely in the work, next work. Thing. We'll see how it goes. Huh, I'm getting tired, boys. Yeah, I mean, it is nine. Yeah. Suck, suck. Question. Something you doing? I think author. Kristen's making some food. Oh, really what, what kind of food? Uh... Probably chicken. We're a big chicken house. Ooh. I like chicken houses. I love chicken. I'm a big chicken fan, to be honest with you. Kate, are we still gonna go eat Chinese food tonight? Yeah. Let's go. I'll Wait, what are you getting? What are you getting tonight? Chinese food. What kind? The kind from China. I'm not sure. I've been Apparently on. It's like inspired. I've been eating a like a lot of Singapore May Fun. <laughs> and that is really good. Do they... I know it's not China, yeah. but like I get racist. it from like, you know, but like <laughs> the chi like the, the typical American Chinese places, they have a little bit of everything. Right. Yeah. And that's what I'll order. Well, but you see, they have a little bit of everything, but they make it up anyway. So. Yeah. Did I get that one right? No. You guys are answering a question right now to save your lives. Oh. Hmm. Na, na, na. Um, 
Now everyone gets what is your guys' <laughs> favorite? These answers yeah, go on. Well, one vote. person said banana, and another person said bananas. <laughs> what did the other person say? <laughs> other chocolate treats. <laughs> well, one is not the white. <laughs> well, I mean, more bananas Why? than chocolate would be better than Exactly, yeah, correct. Yeah, that, than that's chocolate. my logic on that as well. Mm -hmm. Bananas are better than banana. Mm-hmm. I, mean, I haven't had chocolate, a chocolate covered banana in a long time, but I want. I have never had a chocolate covered banana. It's delicious. It's like you buy it at like a banana store, like a, a, a no. boardwalk kind of like street vendor. Lost, guys. <laughs> Who's gonna? I did give say chocolate? banana. Who said bananas? I said Robert. bananas. Right. I said banana. <laughs> banana. I, 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 you just, you just make it yourself. You just get a banana and you melt some chocolate. Put it in the fridge. I, uh, I've never had a banana split either. Uh, freak out. Ba -da -da -ba -da -da. The only place I've ever seen them was at Dairy Queen. And if I'm at DQ, I'm getting a blizzard. So wait, wait, what, what did you say? Chocolate strawberry that you never no, had? No, I've never had a banana split. Oh, they're delicious. Ooh, they're fine. Waterloo is in Belgium. Mm, I've lived. France? I've lived my whole life thinking it was France. I thought it was Let's France. Go! I'm actually smart. Well, Belgium is kind of like. Well, France, you don't anyway. spend all your day on Wikipedia, so that probably gives you the edge there. <laughs> no. All right. I have life. Oh, that it's, was just It's right chalices. There. Uh oh. I poisoned. And it's your Chalice time. number two. Rob, don't take one because I poisoned it. Even if you were mind flooding me, it doesn't matter because Kate could have picked one. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I picked I one. Poisoned three. Yeah, and that's the one you picked, so you, you died. Ah, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I thought I three would have been safe because you guys would have been right like, now, uh, like, well, Rob poisoned three yeah. before. Yeah. So. That's true. I poisoned two. I definitely remembered that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 All right, Kate, you got to get this last question right so we can go to the final round. Oh, no. Kate, I believe I'll probably get it wrong. No, you'll get it right. Kate, don't. How about this? Don't think like that. Yeah, you gotta believe in yourself. <laughs> believe in yourself, Kate. <laughs> there is no question coming up. It's a good point. Question I four. Question. Blame your husband. Yell at him. In Pi, mm -hmm. what are the next sequence of three numbers after 3.14? He's right. Got it. Got it. Why do you remember that? I don't know. Oh, you don't. I remember that too. You don't have to use pi to five digits on a daily basis. Don't <laughs> you just head? memorize numbers for fun? <laughs> 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 Wait, that's how you. That's how you uh, use your free time. I do not know. Instead, actually, my prof gave me a uh, an algorithm to quickly discover the next nine digits in a sequence of pi. I use that instead. Right. No, I've wanted to talk about this for a long time. Can we can we have a short conversation about uh, how you abbreviate professor in verbal speech? We use the term prof all the time. Pro yeah, we say prof. Yeah. What caused sprinter Usain Bolt to trip immediately after winning the 200 meter gold in 2015? A banana. <laughs> oh, I know this. A bananas. Well, I was I thinking banana. Banana. <laughs> banana. <laughs> banana. 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 It was a no, man no. on a Segway. We all got it wrong. No. It was actually a man on a Segway. I want to show you something. I what was he doing on there? there? It was a selfie stick. I put selfie stick. All right, Kate. It's the memory game. This, this is so easy. You got to look at my screen though. Okay. Really this is such an easy pattern to remember. That's gonna take like a whole oh my god. Oh, Kate Luck is actually love. here. Let's go. <laughs> one off, one, one. Got it. It's just a boat with two clouds. All right, that's enough time. <laughs> Yo, know, that's a great way to <laughs> memorize that. As soon as it is gone, I forgot. <laughs> It's Top gone. Well, he just said it. It's Top left, skip one. There's, there are two clouds and one boat. Yeah. 
It's a boat and two clouds. Yeah, you got it. Nice work. It's a. Time, try some it's a boat and two clouds. People. It's a boat and two clouds. One cloud, two boats. Well, no, two two clouds, one boat. Well, the boats are in the sky, and it's just an upside down. Oh, so that's like the that <laughs> oh. civilization that lives on the other side of the flat earth. Yeah. 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 That's where the lizards live. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think lizards live fine yeah, now. In the desert. Yeah, Good underground. Point, yeah. Ooh. And in the soul of Hillary Rodman Clinton. Wow. <laughs> 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 what, do, what do flat earth people believe is going on underneath the earth? Like on the bottom? Moles. Yeah. <laughs> just, moles, they're, Mole. they're able to pierce through the barrier and go to the other side. Okay. For everybody else, the, the, the druid magic keeps us from being able to pierce the veil. <laughs> and moles. And the moles. The mole lords. <laughs> They've constructed a powerful. I'm so I'm so fucking sick of mole lords. Eldritch barrier to conceal their mole technology. Wait, is it just me? For a second it was. Oh yeah, of course, coniferous trees. I I don't know, dude. <laughs> I have no idea. Wait, wait, wait. Is it Douglas fir? That's a Raffi lyric. Have you ever seen a Douglas fir? Fur? C a n a d a. Have you ever heard a bobcat purr? In Canada, we get to see them all. Yo, I didn't even see Douglas fir on my screen. Yeah, you don't get the third answer if you're in first. Yeah. We get to see the maple trees. Maple sugar in the maple. We got the biggest wheat fields growing tall. That's such a good fucking album. I think that should be the it national is. anthem. Yeah. <laughs> it's just Raffi's banana phone, the CD. <laughs> Please rise for the national anthem. Remove your hat. <laughs> it's just an eye for an eye. Really? Yeah. Damn it. <laughs> and he was in the Expendables. Go. He was in the Expendables too. Ghost. Class. What? I said two. I oh my god! I didn't say summit. Oh my. And god. I said damn it and got them all right. <laughs> <laughs> None of these are correct. Flying bear. <laughs> that sounds. That's a great wrestler. Yeah. Yeah. Right. God, I hope a flying. His tag bear team is partner is just player Una. Yeah, just the sun bear. Yeah. They're weird, man. Yeah, they're strange looking. Oh, so got, that's the real tall one. I've come back to life. They got uh, they got real long tongues. Mm. Then why are they called tongue bears? They should be. Mm. Oh my god. Maybe the first person that saw them didn't see them with their mouth open. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and they saw them during the daytime. Yeah, it's because mm. they have this um this this like thing that looks like a like a sun on their <laughs> chest. Yes, chat. <laughs> Fuck Studos. <laughs> <laughs> the Egyptian god Kang. <laughs> <laughs> I chose it because I liked it. Noble gases. I know this one. No, let's go. Farts. <laughs> Noble gases. Nice. nice. You know, it's none of them. Ah, oh, damn it! Oh no, I said butane. I knew it was an oxygen. Why? How did you know butane. that? Well, because it's not a noble gas. Tenth grade. But chemistry. what is a noble gas? Uh, it's a gas that uh, is stable. It doesn't want any protein. Wait, mm. protons. What does that mean? <laughs> Electrons. Yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah. I'll give it protein. It doesn't want any protein. Um, that's a that's about a zero out of a hundred. It's not even protons. It doesn't want any electrons. It's got a stable <laughs> outer valence shell. Protein, but, you know. They're all Harvard <laughs> graduates. They Damn are, it, Conan, yeah. you piece of shit. I didn't know that. Harvard Law. I got the other two. For Mario. Dang it. I almost I didn't, didn't choose Barry. Barry was a freaking Harvard. Ah. Yeah, I almost didn't choose Barry because I was like, I'm, Michelle Obama went there. And I was like, oh shit, didn't they like meet in college or some shit? So I chose that too. 
And because you thought like he wasn't smart enough to go to Harvard? Is that what you're trying to say? <laughs> yeah, but his wow. wife, yeah, but but his wife was. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, oh fuck, I didn't it put hit it. Oh. <laughs> Did I get it all wrong? Mm, yes. Damn it. I know it's the little thing. Dang it. Mm, Pepe the prong. I don't know. Reach. You look so good. You are not. <laughs> <laughs> that was my Yoda. That's his Yoda quote, yeah. That's, that was the Yoda. That Star was my Wars. Yoda. Yeah. It's Empire Strikes Back. If make guns a crime, we do. <laughs> have what the? F only have guns. Criminals will. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Seventeen year old boy, he is not. Hmm? Crisis actor, he is. Hmm? All I, three. I, I picked the final frontier and then thinking, like, I hope it's not because I'm thinking my so press frontier. <laughs> I didn't get a question. Yeah, you died. Like, mm. forever. What the fuck <laughs> does that mean? <laughs> Oh, Ryan would know this 100%. Lennox Lewis. The British Bulldog. Mm. I also picked I also picked Rocky Marciano. He was a champion, uh, but I don't know if he's a heavyweight. I think he might have been a middleweight. Well, I got one British out of three. Bulldog was, and, uh, why don't I he win? just gain some weight right now? <laughs> and I'll be right. Well, Baby boy Smith. He's definitely been dead since like the 40s. But Wait, you win? I got all three right. Yep. <laughs> I win again. You got one right, and I what got heck? three right. Yeah. And I didn't even win. Move. Yet again. I got two right too. <laughs> Excuse me. That's such bullshit. I'm definitely getting one of these cat backpacks. <laughs> <laughs> I'd recommend you it. You go to the Amazon. Go to the Amazon, and then get the ones that are from China. They're exactly the same. The quality is good. And it's fifty dollars instead of three hundred dollars. There's like this one gift that I'm gonna retweet right now, and it's like this dude just dragging his cat across like the lawn by a leash. <laughs> the cat's not having any of it, but it's just laying there. You did indeed retweet that. Oh, uh, it's a pretty good one. I'm so mad. Why? <laughs> Wait, because I went, <laughs> I went four and zero. Oh. <laughs> because because I, I've got three right, you only got one right. It's bullshit. I was only one behind you. Why? I got two right, and I was I was two behind you, I think. Why don't we take some time to pimp our channels? We'll start with uh, Kate. Hey, I'm Kate. I spell K in number eight. I <laughs> stream often, well, almost every day, but probably not today because I feel like I need to rest and drink some water a little bit. Um, but I'll be streaming tomorrow. Uh, not sure. Maybe Mega Man 4. Maybe finish up Don Greed. Maybe uh, continue with the what that game Horizon Zero Dawn. I don't know, but yeah, come and check it out. Sweet. How about you, Josh? Hi, I'm Josh. I spell it J with an eight. You can find me. <laughs> J. J. <laughs> Little J. You find me hanging around doing cool things whenever you want to see it and I'll be right there I'm Josh and Rob and he spells it with J8 <laughs> uh, hi I'm uh, I'm Rob uh, that's spelled uh, uh, R8 um, that's not fair because I, I was going to use that and <laughs> yeah, too late you could be R8 right right um, yeah uh, so you can find me at Alpaca Patrol everywhere, Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube, discord.gg slash Alpaca Patrol as well, which is what we're using to do the NLSS today, mm -hmm. funnily enough. It's true. Um, yeah. Uh, and, uh, yeah, also, uh, movie nights on Saturdays. Uh, they're a fun time, so come by next Saturday and we'll watch a movie together. Uh, and it will be, uh, lovely. 
Sweet. Dude, I just saw this Clickhole article. Uh -huh. I think Clickhole might have surpassed the onion for me in terms of like thing that always makes me laugh. Inspiring! Okay. This video game developer is making his employees work 18 hour days and weekends to make sure the main character has a purple hat. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh, it's so good. He has to change the periodic table of elements. <laughs> Gets me every time. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna hang up on you guys. Thanks for being here. Are you gonna hang up on right. me? Oh, well, you're yeah. not gonna say how you spell your name? Well, I am good, but I'm gonna do it privately. But do it, like, right here, just for this. Yeah, for and, then, and then you can I'm hang right up the call. Alright, hey, yeah. my name's Ryan, spelled R8. What an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's stupid, because I already said that! That's why it's stupid. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> Alright, I'm, I'm gonna hang up now. Are we satisfied? <laughs> Alright, oh, goodbye, oh my lord. Okay, bye, thanks guys. for having me. Of course, me. thanks for being yeah, here. Thanks, thanks for being here. Hello. That was a good... Show and now I'll read out a bunch of names. Streamlabs definitely 100% did not catch you all, so I apologize. Oh, hello, Jim Puff. Hi, I apologize in advance. But taste the beams, Maxi Amaru, not a man bun, Seleucius, I am the cheese 42, Kai Newman, Shamalama, Loco Loco 143, Defaultier, Resner, Detention, Reviax, Ravox. I am gonna make my own chat scrubber to get a list of subscribers, for real. Cause like... Streamlabs does a bad job of catching all of them. I'm not saying mine's gonna do a great job. It's not gonna be better than Streamlabs, but it'll probably be better than Streamlabs at actually getting all the l names from the list. Plus I already got that Spirebot account I'm not doing anything with because Slay the Spire undercut me. Mega crit. I subbed? We'll see if that's true, Goldfish Vendor. We'll see if that's true. And now, according to this, if I sub, I get nine emotes and I get to play with you on Sundays? Well, on the bright side, you don't get to play with me on Sundays, but on the negative side, you get like triple the amount of emotes that looked like you were supposed to, so they're even better. Resner, Detention, Ryback, Slowly Clapping, Captain Cuttlefish, you got to be kidding me, Toxic Wind, Unguard, Bismuth K, Ingvar GB1, Quizzical Upnod, Wowie123, Mystic Plato, Briar Soul, Dan Lipman Music, Nitrusty Man, Cogs and Gears, Litigious Squid, Bortogo1, Demons on Pacto, Code 1005, DFFG 720, Bonesaw 9, Azanox, Last Station Knight, Whoppers, oh thank you, Captain Dick Puncher, Nagito Chimeda, Boss D Man, SCK Roo, Dosh Cannon, Gunther the Penguin, Simple Vol 2, President of Math, Goldfish Vendor, I told you, Francis Dillinger, Spider Cancer, Nihil TV, Wumk, Rage Squid, Doc Holiday 92, Chindragosa, Damonson, Get Dusted Yon, Hamster Eater, Hypercam, Kairu 7, Kuzlus, Put on your Sunday shoes, Don't Panic, Spaghetti, Watch Jack, Turkey Ham, Ellie Angler, Alice Shaky Ole, Doc Innocent, Doc Innocent, Castrato Mech, Edmund, Balikma, Space Dookie, At Dupe, DJ Abner 375, Amaranth the Lair, Amaranth Thelery, maybe? I'm trying. Blue Green Zebra, Nostalgic, Young Boa 15, Lismanite, Banana Gobs, Beaconatrix, Durkatank 798, Daglas, Batman 227, Chundi 43, Nudie 75. Yeah, Hizzles. Pex985, Soviet Burrito, Stino Rhino, Might Bear, Jokerus, Sporty Mort, Dvorak2, Stern Payton. You ain't got no alibi. You ugly, I get it. General Guide, Me Mechimp, or Mech Imp, depends on the capitalization, I suppose. Yohalis, Sassanox, Aether, Ethereum Fox, Carson DM, Luke Shaman, Chew Cannon. Singer Rhymes, The Provocative Ambulance, Canaris, Code Monkey Like You, Scastilla, Overlord King, Tom Seo, OO at 30, Slave to the Vaporwave, Lord Zongno, 
Respawn Pawn, Orange Slayer, Ocarius, Jason LV9, Zaphod B, Captain Pikmin, Gold Hypercurve, Northern Leo, Emperor Vespasian, EEDQSA, Crasher457, OFWF, Aharon211, The Paper Chase Guy, Rylor, Mosky B, Veritas Leo, Polygon95, Amyow, Muscles McGee, Quilly Face, Dry Ice Rock, Dr. Docket, Thanefo, Some Call Me Face, DB25, DB24, Tachyon, Arctic EXE, Flux DZ, Itchy87, Raritan, Rar Titan, that's it, Riley X Storm, X Tank911, Rob Boberts, Bergian, Sub the Tank, Odin the Dog, MTF Sandlin, Jojo Face, ID319, Slothy222, Static OJ, Danzica15, Pajama Wearing Wizard, SJS42, Visit85, Richmond, CSO, Squiver, Chris Haste02, Sinful LP, Lunigator, That Boy Unknown, Dark Sim4, Forever Ska, Headless Hippo 093, Craigor 001, Fudge Brown 93, Fudge Brown 93, Scoot Senpai, a Fudge Brown 93, Dominic DQ, Skeletal Soup, Elemental Ergdu, Fudge Brown 93, Trev Death, a Lonely Sock, Fudge Brown 93, Mr. Teal 26, Val Nassar, Targan, Jacob. Jacobian Ed, Vilhel, Tone Low, Raizu, Aralox, uh, Fudge Brown 93, Fudge Brown 93, Ling Lord, and Shattered Nirvana. Thank you guys very much. Fudge Brown 93, thank you for the generous cheers. Thanks for everybody for watching, being nice in chat, making an effort to support, watching the show without ad block, etc., etc. It sounds like Kate will not be live after the show. So, Red Abyss, thank you as well. I will host somebody else. For now, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Probably tomorrow? Maybe? Yeah, I don't know. We'll see.